Oh man, are we live? Dang, the beef sector is the sector that keeps on giving. Let's get it. Listen to me. I carry that kind of love in my heart that you would never find. See niggas scared of they demons. I make friends with mines. I might have been the truth, but I never lied. I need something to feel alive when I'm dead inside. All my personal issues I'm learning to set aside. Cause I planted the seed and niggas came with pesticides. Give y'all my testimony, but never would testify. Well, buy lunch for the reaper to see who next to Bitch, I've been cold since the snotty nose. Since I was drinking tap water out the water hose. Since I was stealing shit from Trey, cause my main bought me clothes. Since I was robbing people houses and got on a roll. Shit, I was nine when I made the decision. I'm a gold platinum like Fubu. That's when I learned the same ones who love you or try to use you. Everybody trying to win, so nobody cry when they lose you. We had nothing in the crib, we could eat but some ramen noodles. What is up, you two? It's your boy, Dr. Binary, back at you with another live video. Hey, dang, we got so much to cover. So much to cover in so little time. Welcome to the morning commute. This has been great. I, I love this show. I ain't even going to hold you. I love this show. I love getting you guys up and ready for the effery. That's how I feel. I feel like that is my job. That is my duty. When you wake up and you're getting ready for work, right? And you're getting ready for this long, grueling day of, of, of blue collar, white collar work, right? I'm getting the stage set for the effery. You know what I mean? Like, it's, it's just, you know, I, I, I love the title. I love my job. I love my role. Because I'm telling y'all, yesterday was a day. And I don't like how people get mad that I take credit. Why do you get upset that I take a little bit of credit? That doesn't make any sense. Why, why can't I take just a little bit of credit? Why? We're going to talk about a lot of things today. We're going to talk about how D. Durrell got lined up. Lord, he got lined up. And I think we're going to spend majority of the time. Listen, we might not even get to the other two uh, uh, items on the docket today. Because there, there is so much there. There is so much psychology. There is so much uh, uh, under uh, shade. There's so much beef. There's so much jealousy. There are so many things within that four-hour span that it might, shoot, the Treasure and the ZX might have to wait until tomorrow, but I'm going to try my hardest to get through the docket. Seriously, I, I really am. But gosh, there's so much there. What are you doing, though? Like, what are you doing right now? Have you had your coffee? Had you had, have you had your tea? Are you addicted to caffeine? If you didn't have coffee in the morning, what would your morning really, really, really look like? Some of y'all, some of y'all be smoking the hell out of some weed. If you went one day without smoking weed, how would that day be? Would you, would that whole day just be you thinking about it? Like, how would that day really, really be? What are you addicted to? What is it that you're addicted to? Because I'm telling you, if I go one day without YouTube, I'll probably start scratching and shit. Probably start scratching. All right, we're going to jump right into this. Like I said, I don't have very much time. It is Wednesday. It's hump day. It is hump day. Uh, yeah, you guys can look at that in so many different ways. Uh, you can start your day off right. <laughs> if you know what I mean, it's hump day. You, know what I'm saying? you can start your day off right. Or you can end your day right. You know what I'm saying? It don't matter, but it's hump day. There's a certain type of energy on Wednesday. I still didn't break out my little energy chart uh, telling me, like, what kind of energy I'm supposed to be having on these days. You know what I mean? But it is Wednesday. <sighs> Today's a planning day for me. 
I'm going to go to work and I'm doing, I'm going to plan out probably the next two weeks. So it's a planning day for me. It's a good day. It's a relaxed day. Not too, not too hectic. I like Wednesdays. I like Wednesdays. All right. So y'all already know, y'all already know what's about to happen. If you want me to shout you out, if you want me to say what's up, like, like on a personal level, go ahead and drop something in the chat right now. And I will get to it. Codification squad. Cause I don't think I heard you right. Say it again. Say it again. I guess. Sure. I guess. Sure. What I said was. What I said was. I love you, Naruto. And you also need to know that Sasuke doesn't. I love you, Benji. It's totally crazy to ever like him in the first place. Girl, I shy for you. I don't wanna say I lie, but I lie for you. And I wanna say I cry, but I cry for you. All these tears on my eyes and they fall for you. And they fall for you. All these hoes on my phone, but I'm calling you. I throw the bumps and the lows, cause I'm calling you. Throw them off for you. Where I'll be. Girl, I shy for you. I wanna say I lie, but I lie for you. And I wanna say I cry, but I cry for you. All these tears on my eyes and they fall for you. And they fall feel, and they fall feel, and they fall in. Yeah, they fall feel, and they fall feel. I'm falling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I found a cheat code. The earlier I do this, the easier it is for me because, man, it's hard for me to keep up sometimes in the chat. But what's up, girl, by the mystic? Let me know why me being a Virgo is like a hmm moment, like a ah oh, shit type moment. Let me know. I don't understand. I don't understand. Miami Popo. Now, does that mean Miami police? Like, what is, what's the popo? Like, I don't understand it, but thank you for being here. Because I know in the chat, sometimes you be giving me a hard time. When I be on the panels talking my shit, sometimes you sometimes you be giving me a hard time when I'm in other people's chats. And, uh, when, I'm a, when I am on other folks' panels, you be giving me a hard time. But thank you so much for being here. What's up, Fave? What's going on? What's going on? You staying out of trouble? You staying out of trouble? How many troll accounts you got? You got any troll accounts? Because, man, you be you be talking shit. You be talking shit. And I'm pretty sure all the shit you be talking, sometimes you don't want it associated with your name. So so how many troll accounts you got? What's up, friend? How's the assembly line treating you? Do you have to wear uh, one of those things? Wait, not a bonnet, but uh, dang, what is it called uh, to keep your hair out of the stuff? Oh, my gosh. See, and see, people try to fault me for not knowing shit. But my my brain, like seriously, sometimes I can't really even think about it. Uh, what is it called when you just put? A, I'm just gonna say hair protector. I don't know what the shit is called. But do you wear one of those things, like a shower cap looking type thing, like a cap? Do you wear a cap on your head at work? Do you wear a cap on your? And do you have to wear gloves? That's all. I'm just I'm curious to know. Welcome to the show, Precious Pisces sixty nine. Good to see you. Uh, there you are showing off again. Showing off. How long you gonna keep this avatar? How long you gonna keep this avatar? You know, the other avatar was pissing people off because you look too, you look too damn happy. This avatar just says life is great. Like life is even greater. So I already get what's going on. I get what's going on. What's up, LC? What's up, Lassie? How are you? How are you, soul sister? Hopefully life is good. Hopefully you're doing great. You know what I mean? There's a lot going on on these YouTube streets. Hopefully you can keep up. What's up, Diva D? Welcome. Love your avatar. It brings good vibes to me. Ah, uh, there is the YouTube shorts queen right here. Uh, her shorts are very, very entertaining. I can't wait for the algorithm to go ahead and catch those in, uh, and you get all the views that you deserve. Thank you, Lolo, for being here. What's up, my good friend? This the homie. This the homie right here. What's up? In the clouds. I hope everything is going well with you, man. It's good to see you. Thank you for being here. We got a crazy show today, bro crazy show man it's it's insane what it what it is though oh i see you done changed your profile pic you trying to join the ranks of roxy you and your wifey look way too damn happy now is that a play because you know over here in the beach sector everything's a damn play look how they wearing them hats and sunglasses together is that even his wife for real? Is is unadulterated running a play? You know, everything's a damn play. <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> 
Hey, girl, what you doing over there? Oh, I'm just listening to Cole Fam right now. He talking shit. Really? Really? What's his channel? I ain't even going to give you his channel because you might be trying to call his job, girl. You might be trying to call his job. <laughs> What's up, Ghostface Keisha? What's up? I love, damn, that avatar is dope. I wonder if Lemon is jealous of your avatar. That avatar is fire. Yeah, your mask looks better than Lemon's mask. I'm just saying. He, he probably going to hate me for saying that. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you already know you flexing. Stop. You already know you flexing out here. Stop. Stop. Demita Joe. Demita Joe got that look on her face, don't she? She got that look on her face like, I am established. I am accomplished. She got that look on her face like, also, also that look is, yeah, yeah, go ahead and try it if you want to try it. I am established, I am accomplished, but go ahead and try it if you want to try it. She got that look. Welcome to the show, Superstar. It's good to have you here. Oh, hell. You had a mod stick? You had a mod stick. Really? Hmm. Hmm. Let me, let me hook up the homie. That's that's the homie right there. There you go, brother. There you go. Well, thank you for tuning in, though. Seriously, th seriously, because I know my morning shows. It's hard for you sometimes to catch, but I appreciate you for tuning in. And uh, and I think um, just saying, I know you changed your avatar, but you probably changed your avatar because Ghostface Keisha, her avatar, man, whoo, that avatar is fire. And you was probably looking at that like, yo, man, she done stole my idea, man. She got a mask on and shit, man. And her mask is doper than mine, man. You know how Lemon be talking. Her mask be doper than mine, man. Fuck all that, man. I got to change my avatar, man. Fuck all that. <laughs> What's up, Simply Made? Good morning. <laughs> look, at, look at Simply Made's avatar. She's side-eyeing the hell out of the Umar boys, ain't she? <laughs> you motherfucking Umar boys. <laughs> Simply made side eyeing the shit out of us, ain't she? <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Did I? Oh, Dirty Sector. Did I review it? Oh shit. Oh shit. You see, people don't understand. I love the Dirty Sector. I love the Dirty Sector. Oh man, was it just was it the same name? And I reviewed it. Was it the same name? Because man, when y'all be going in and roasting that shit, whoo, damn. Y'all, y'all be really going in, really going in. They be going in over here at the B sector too, but damn, y'all be going in. Ah, there's the homie right there. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, but Honest Rose, who I'm talking about. So thank you, girl by the Mystic. You just swooped in and just took over the uh the comments. You know what I'm saying? I was trying to highlight Honest Row. What's up, bro? Good to see you. Thank you so much for being here, man. I really do appreciate you being here. Like I said, uh, I, I, I just. I love your show, man. I, I just love your attitude. I love your personality. All that fun stuff, bro. So thank you again for being here. All right. I got 10 minutes to talk my shit before we get into the first item of the docket. All right. So uh, Sexy Toy Lady from my sector had a live stream. Make sure you guys go check out that live stream. Because uh, at the beginning of that live stream, some new information came about. Now, I know the, the first title or the first uh, item on the docket is D. Durrell got lined up. But what you might want to do is go to Sexy Toy Lady's page. If, if, the, if, the, uh, if she's here, can you please drop your link? If she's not here, can somebody find her link and drop it? Because uh, they have... Okay, okay. how can I say this without Dieterrell thinking I'm talking shit? Because I'm not talking shit. I promise you I'm not talking shit. MBK is in the building. What's up, big dog? MBK is here. Uh, yeah, I'm not talking shit. Um, uh, they played some... <sighs> <sighs> they play they played something uh with D Durrell involved in um it's not a good look. It's not a good look. 
D. Durrell uh, um, was speaking on pretty much how a woman can finish. You know, if y'all, if y'all, if y'all are uh, handling business, and you know the climax happens, you know. But he was talking about how a woman can finish by simply getting her let me stop let me stop y'all need to go y'all need to go watch that shit i am not even gonna finish uh uh what i'm about to say but y'all need to go watch that sexy toy lady has the t on that so make sure y'all get over there and watch that after this or after shot kim or after whatever because yeah it was information i wasn't privy to that i don't even know if 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 I even want to even know that, <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't even know if I even want to, if I even want to know that information, but the information is out there. Um, yeah, go check it out. The information's out there. Uh, if somebody drops it in the chat and they, and they could guess what I'm talking about, I will go ahead and bring it up, but I don't really want to bring it up on my own because I don't feel comfortable. I don't feel comfortable. Um, and before we get into the items on the docket, let me just go ahead and say this. There are multiple layers to the beef sector. There are different fractions, facets, areas uh, of the beef sector. Um, and it all depending on which kind of lane you're driving in within the beef sector because i'm starting to find out that the beef sector is huge wait hold on hold on so are you saying it was on tiff p's channel because i thought it was on your channel hmm what are you trying to say what are you trying to say I know she's the one that talked about it, but isn't the traction on your channel? Make sure you drop your link, homegirl. Please make sure you drop your link. Um, depending on what area or lane you're driving in on the beef sector, that is going to actually dictate your mood. That's crazy to me. That happens in my sector, but on a very, very small scale. Meaning, if you enter into my sector on one side, because there's like one, there's like two sides pretty much in my sector. If you enter on one side, it is going to dictate how you kind of view things in your mood or whatever, or whatever. But then you eventually kind of merge the two and then you feel a certain type of way. You know what I mean? Then you feel a certain type of way. What I'm finding. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Star got the audio. And that's what I was listening to. Uh, do we want to send them to Tiff P? Do we want to send them to Tiff P? Mm, Tiff P be erasing. Tiff P be deleting too much of her shit. So that's why you already know what I'm doing. Stop. Drop, drop, drop your link. Stop playing. <laughs> You go to Tiff P's right now, the shit's gone. <laughs> Stop playing. Um, but anyways, if you go to certain areas within the B sector, it dictates your effing mood. Like, like I'm glad that I entered in. Barn Dog is here. What's up? Mrs. Murph is here. What's goody? What's goody? What is up? What is up, y'all? I'm so glad I entered the B sector the way that I did. I entered through uh, through Lemon's platform. You know what I mean? I entered through Lemon's platform. And Lemon's platform is very inviting. It's very, very inviting. And through that platform, I was able to navigate, you know, my way to Ness and to Brie. Right? And you have to remember, Lemon is the one that told me to uh, go visit Ness. So Lemon is the one that dictated where I kind of went in the beginning. And I'm so glad that he did because I'm starting to see he sent me to welcoming platforms. 
he sent me to where to where uh he knew people weren't going to be so stoic dogmatic and in in harsh now i'm not saying that he sent me to somewhere where people were going to be soft because brie and ness were far from soft far from soft they were side eyeing me from jump far from soft you know what i mean so so i'm thankful the way that i entered in here and another thing that we could talk about a little bit later is um People keep, keep people keep saying that I came in here with some type of team. I came in here like, oh, uh, I forgot the gentleman that was talking on Treasure uh, Lane's uh, panel that was trying to compare himself with us and how we entered in, right? Oh, you was joking? Sorry, brother. Uh, it's too late now. You, you done associated yourself with me. <laughs> you in trouble, brother. You in trouble. <laughs> Sector J, what's up? Sector J, what's up? Yeah, you loving the title, huh? Yeah. And the only thing about the title is it's true. The damn title is true. It is true. Um, but yeah, uh, what was I even talking about? Damn it. Damn it, what was I talking about? I know I was talking. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, where well, a guy was like, look, this is how I'm different. How I entered into uh the B sector, and this is how I'm different. I came in solo dolo. They came in as a team, even though what he was saying was exactly what we did. What he's saying is exactly what we did. I didn't come in as no team, brother. I came in this thing by myself, and then after that, people kind of followed me over here. I can't help that. I did send out the bat signal, like, Lemon, let us in. If you want to come over, come over. So I did send the bat signal. But, bro, I came in by myself, man. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. All I can hear is, do your history. Do your research. History, research, research, history. Do your research. Do your history. And all of these people. Oh, shit. Girl, stop. Oh, you done made it official. You done made it official. Thank you so much, Sophisticated Brat, for becoming a member. I'm getting a lot of Dr. Binary members. Uh, so what I need to do is start doing a lot more community posts. So I'm going to start doing a lot more community uh, community wall posts to, to kind of keep you guys engaged on what's going on. Especially how they trying to line me up. Like, they really trying to line me up. Mm -hmm. Damn it. I forgot, to, I forgot to get the members link. Damn, Shaquem, you got me, bro? Come on, Shaquem, you got me. Shaquem put me up on game, and I still forgot to do that shit. I can't do it at my job. I can't do shit at my job. Because if you do stuff at your job and the B sector find out, some of these mother effers in the B sector will call your job. Hey, did you know that binary code was making stickers for his, was making emojis for his channel? Did you know that on company time? <laughs> What's up? What's up, Sheffy? What's up, Sheffy? Thank you, Sophisticated Brad, for becoming a member. I really, really do appreciate that. Look at Eartha. Eartha is here. What's up, friend? What's up, friend? Yeah, Binary be making, uh, he be making emojis on company time. Is he allowed to do that? Is he really allowed to do that? Check his laptop. Look at his laptop. See if he got those sticker emojis on his laptop. <laughs> I know what you're doing. You talking to your friend in the in the next uh in the next cubicle over. Binary over there being messy, girl, girl. You need to stop being messy talking about Ness losing her job over some YouTube stickers and shit. Binary, you better stop being messy this morning, Binary. <laughs> now, precious Pisces, you know what's crazy is I always do that voice. I always do that voice. I just gave you that voice. Now, if I would have did that voice, I'm gonna drop a name and watch. I'm gonna get in trouble. If I would have did that voice after talking about Lady Nika. 
all of a sudden I, I got hell to pay. I got hell to pay. I don't understand the sensitivity. Like, I don't get it. Like, I don't understand. Oh, yeah. Right. Right. You already trying to get into it. Oh, I'm a minute over. I got to drop the damn link. Look, my time is up already. You already trying to get into it. God damn. She already trying to get into it. Look, I'm going to drop this link. Anybody is welcome up on the panel. And I always have to do this disclaimer. Maybe I should have it written down and make it a damn whatever, a banner or whatever. I'm going to get through my docket. I may not get through the whole thing this time because there's so much because D. Durrell got lined up and it was nasty work. It was nasty work. People, a person used her personal relationship with D. Durrell to bring him up on a panel just to shoot his ass down. <laughs> but we gonna talk about it. We gonna talk about it. So when I drop this link and pin this link, anybody is welcome up here. We could talk about it. But just remember, I have a show to do. And so I'm going to either cut you off if you get long winded. You know what I mean? I'm going to cut you off because we got to keep pushing forward. My job is to really get through this docket. Like I said, I when I was taking notes for the first item on the docket, the notes went so damn long, and I don't think I've ever had notes this damn long on a on a beef sector docket ever before. So I don't know how much time uh, it's going to take. This might even be a part two series. I don't even know. But anyways, there's a show on the panel, but there's also an even better show in the chat. So if you are in the chat, at least communicate with one another. At least communicate with one another. Engage in the chat because I love reading the chat after the show is over. Yeah, girl, I take notes. You didn't know that? Heck yeah, I'll be taking notes. Especially since I'm not going to be playing other people's content. <laughs> Shout out to Shaquem. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I am not going to be playing other people's content. <laughs> Let me go ahead and uh, pin that. So I got I to gotta take hella notes. Shoot, shoot. D. Darrell, look. No, we're going to get into it. Let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. Oh, damn. Here we go. Here we go. Let me give y'all a second. Let me give y'all a second. Let me give you a second. Okay, I'm starting to learn my lesson. Just bringing people up as soon as they come up. I'm going to give you a second. Let you get your uh, get your, get your your clothes on. and <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Hey, what's up, girl? Yes, it's me and you. Mm -hmm. There's another. But I'm just giving you, you were the first one to hit the link, so. I'm, I feel like know. I can hold other. Keep going. Yeah, there's, a, there's another. Okay, uh, let me bring. What's up, ah! <laughs> MBK. Mm -hmm. Sheffy be loving some MBK. I've, I've noticed I do, that when I, I was in the chat. I some MBK binary. I really do. Mm -hmm. um, uh, what's let's up, keep going. Sir? Let's keep going. Okay, what's up, yeah. MBK? I got I got one thing to say. Ah, oh, shit. Go ahead. Oh, wait. Oh, when you're cleaning up, oh, when you're cleaning up, yeah. So you don't know that's the intro to Treasure Lane's uh, show. So, oh, that's right. Oh, uh, that's, shit. That's, that's, that's all right. I got to say today. Yeah, let's uh, clean it up. <laughs> look, look, man. If we get there today, great. If not, that's okay because that was gives that me a, a middle show finger on the, Was that a middle finger on the title? That's a middle finger, yes. <laughs> I didn't say I, I, I'm confused at that, but okay. No, well, I, I put the title up before ah, it ended okay ah. so so in the beginning when he was giving his uh monologue or whatever he was uh -huh. pretty much saying i don't give a damn which is which is beautiful right that, 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 that's isn't beautiful. that what you wanted in bk yes 100 percent. Right. isn't that what you wanted that's, that's what fact. i'm saying treasure lane hit us the umar boys and no. mbk but it, uh, 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 he, he not said not the Umar boys. He didn't say MBK. He said the Umar boys. Well, MBK is associated with us. Yeah, but yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, but you I'm, know I'm he didn't mean him though. Yeah, but I'm Paul. I'm, I think I'm, he you thinks know, you guys gonna... are together. Sheffy, can you please <laughs> stop stop with the man crush just for a little bit right now? No, please. I'm just saying he thinks you guys are together. I know MBK is different. I don't think he knows the difference. Lord, and that's my point. So he hit us all with that middle finger. Yeah, but 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 that that middle finger just meant. That's what he would do to everybody. So he'd yep. give everybody the middle fuck you, right? So I thought I took that as a, okay, cool. Now, no, it's a compliment. 
Right. If he would have came now. on, right. if he would have came on and said, you know, yeah, no, like, what are those guys it's, doing not here? A, it's not a compliment, guys. No, it's a compliment. If, trust. If, if he had to say, uh, if he had to come, okay. If he had to come on and said, like the one from other, the beef sector. If he had to come on and say some of that other crazy stuff that some of the other people were saying, then I would, you know, but but I've been watching him long enough to know that he's sensible. And like they were saying, he don't care about that kind of stuff. None of the older people seem to care. It's this young crowd that want to gangbang. The Stop people. saying it's the young crowd when the old crowd is the one that be attacking y'all. Old crowd hasn't attacked us. Mm, I don't know. I know you oh, have. What? I know you have some affection what? for the well, old, wait a minute. old slow head. Down, slow, down, slow, slow, nah. slow down. Slow down. Hold up. Come Sheffy, on now. Down. No, you. No, I think. Sheffy, you hold on. Slow down. Sheffy, Sheffy, no, MBK. I think. Can I answer the question? Can I answer it? Okay, but I think you should slow down too. You can relax. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead, MBK. Um, and then we're gonna jump. Into what what I'm saying time. is, the older people we haven't been interacting with, the people that have been attacking us, not the Umar boys attacking this us in this commentary we've been doing. Those people are not the old people because they don't even really know the difference between the Umar boys and this commentary and what. Whoever. Yeah, I I have to agree to disagree, brother. Yeah, I, I have to definitely disagree. So, so who, man. You're so doing which, a lot. Old, man. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me ask you a question. Which old timer? Which old timer attacked the show? Attack the show? I don't know, but which well, old timers? No, hold on. But which old timers have been coming uh coming at us? Uh, well, if you come lot. at us, that's attacking the show because that's okay. This, this a stuff. lot of them, a lot of them. They are they're yeah, all side. Always, they're hang all on, side you, you, Hang on, hang on. Right. Side, side iron is okay, but we're into that back and forth verbal beefs with the people we've been interacting with, which were not those people. We hadn't. I remember, I said we hadn't got to that level yet. They they just started. Binary, okay, okay. I can kind Binary, of. Binary. Can I just remind you? Oh of something? my god. <laughs> Go ahead. He not beef sector. Damn. Like I'm just saying. Why, 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 what, what is the purpose of this? Like, why, what, what does that have to do with anything that we're talking about? I don't know. Are, are you, are you, are, no, no. <laughs> well, let me ask this. They told me you want to be, they told you me you want to be sucked either, Chef. But you binary, ain't let's be honest. You ain't beef sucked either. He's not beef sucked. I'm more beef sucked than you are. Yeah, I'm not trying to be beef sucked. Like, what are you talking about? But like, you, you really talk a lot about yeah, this. Yeah, you ain't beef sucked. See, what she's going to do is make me, well, he ain't beef sucked. She's going to make me turn it on her now. Right, you you're the part of the beef sector that's the problem. You're, you're the problem. Okay, see, I'm all see. That's what <laughs> you always ask for. You asking I for? I didn't like, ask for okay. anything. I'm just beef sector. You telling me I'm not beef sector, so but I have a right not. to tell you, you that you're the problem. You said you're not beef sector. You said okay. you're black sector. That'd be triggering. I accept, I accept That'd that. Be triggering. But what I'm That'd trying to tell you is that you can tell me that I can be honest and tell you that you're the problem with the beef sector. I never, I never said any of that shit that you're talking about. You're the problem. Now ask me how oh, you're the problem. Okay, I'm the problem, but you're not you. even beef sector to tell me that I am the problem. You don't you have to be beef sector. You're outside parasite that telling me that I am a problem when I'm not a problem. I think you're the problem telling me that I am a problem. I understand that, Sheffy. I understand. Thank yeah, you, I mean, Binary. Because Cole, what because Cole wants about? to be. Because Cole Thank wants you, to be Binary. The... Thank yeah, you, man. Yeah, yeah. I get you. Go ahead, Thank MBK. You. Well, are you going to stop her from cutting me off, or like, what, what, like, what are we I'm doing? Trying, this, 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 why is it always that I'm cutting like, okay. you off, or I'm disrespecting okay. you when I'm not? <laughs> Go ahead, you MBK. always make it seem that way, and you, I'm you, usually you the one I that's on talk. mute. Let him Go. talk, Sheffy. Come on, let him. Okay, you. yes, Thank sir. You. Thank you. Go ahead. So, Go ahead. If you like can, I then we got to get into the docket. Go ahead. Yeah, really. And I don't even know why we're going down this lane, but this is what she wants. You brought it up. <laughs> Come on, man. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, I, brought up, I, I brought up the I'm not part of the beef sector? Or did she just tell me that? No, you brought I up the topic. No, but that's she, not what I'm talking about. I'm, I'm talking about ahead, what she's brother. talking about right now as far as me not you being You just able want me to be the bad guy. I'm not the bad guy in BK. You know what? Forget it, man. Okay. It's just this killing my whole energy, man. You got it. <laughs> well, yeah, MPK, sometimes when you be talking about the beef sector and stuff, you be killing my energy too. And that's fine, but listen to it. It's okay, commentary. but then when you get your energy, it is too. great commentary. Jesus, man, you can we just get right to now? the next topic? You just know the vibe. Whole, the vibe is no, the vibe is dope. Can vibe we just? Dope. She's just killing your. She's just killing your. What is, uh, I, I have to. I have about. to. Binary, I have to. Right. Okay. 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 The, the vibe is dope. She's just trying to kill your momentum on what you're trying to say as far as like you be talking a lot. I like it though. I like I like what he has to say. You know what I mean? I, I do too. It, even but if you're, I, I never right. said I never like what he had to say, right? I really well, do. You did just say that. 
You did just no, say, I didn't. And you just said I he ain't beast not. sector. You did just say he ain't beast sector. That is correct. Try to, to try to throw him off. Right. So, 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 but he so agrees now with I have me. the right to respond. Right. Okay. Right respond okay. You got one. That. You got one minute. Ready? Oh, Jeffy, okay. we have to mute. We have it's to mute. Very, it's very simple, right? No, I am not the beef sector, and we've established that long ago. So if that's your only comeback, I mean, you sound silly. So you you claim you are the beef sector, and the people in the beef sector told me you're not. And and as far Damn. as I see, you people like you who run around yelling beef sector all day that make no content, you are the problem. Damn. So 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 that's I mean it's all in a nutshell. No, I'm not beef sector. Never lobbied or tried to be. I do commentary on the beef sector, right? Just like anybody else does commentary on what they see. You're trying to make the beef sector your lifeline. You're jumping over a hurdles and everything trying to get in, and you're still not it. So what are we talking about here? What is your point? Did you think you were gonna get cool points with the beef sector? Okay, for how many seconds does he have left? All right, like, that's one minute. That's right one now. minute. Okay, that's right. one fucking. You can't interrupt. Minute. Go ahead. Uh, go ahead, Sheffy. Go ahead. You got one minute, and then we're getting into the. Doctor I am bro. beef sector. Something that you can't be. You are fucking okay. black sector. That you don't I'm never not... motherfucker. You got to mute. You got to mute, NBK. Right. You are black sectors. You always talk shit about. You've been talking about the beef sector since you motherfucking came up to be since your motherfucking inception. You're not beef sector. You keep talking shit about us, and we're we're acknowledging you, but like we really don't, right? This is our really first time, our last month that, or last two weeks that we've actually motherfucking talked about you, right? You have been hitting, um, you've been hitting link to link to link to link to say that you're like this, you this whole motherfucking guy, but you're not. You're actually melding yourself with the Umar boys, right? And I have to keep telling people that you're not Umar boys, right? Seems like you're trying to be somebody that you're not. So I am I, I'm Sheffy. I am beef sector. I am that nigga. You follow me. Where's my fifty dollars when I go live? That's Damn. All right. There we and go. Also, there we go. And that's it. And okay, guys, we gotta move on. Okay. No, no, no. Oh, gotta okay, move on. Jeffy. All right, yeah, the first yeah, item on the that. docket. Here it is. <laughs> that's enough of that. The setup, the old bait and switch. Darrell on Olivia's, right? Her name's Olivia, Ooh. right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, the Oracle. All right, let me put this ticker up since Sheffy be hating on my hating on my damn whatchamacallit. I just want to see MBK more often. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get it. Lee Darrell's got to put his, he got to put his vest on tight because they they <laughs> they jumped him. They were shooting at him. He had snipers <laughs> on the roof. He had all kinds of shit going on. So Olivia the Oracle sends the bat signal to Dee Darrell yesterday to have a discussion. And the problem is, is she wanted to have a discussion on other people. So it wasn't as if she wanted to talk solely about D. Durrell and his involvement with the Beef Sector uh, slash Umar Johnson boys merger. She wanted to talk about me and Shaquem. And first and foremost, the misconception that the Umar Johnson sector actually talks about Umar Johnson is hilarious to me. It's hilarious <laughs> because we don't we, we can give two shits about Umar right now. Although majority of us in the sector... We have extensive knowledge about Umar and his situation, and we can speak on the issues. If outsiders bring that up, okay, fine. We will start speaking on it or whatever. But we find it funny when somebody from our sector gets cornered um, to talk about Umar because we don't even talk about that Negro. May, no may I interject? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so, Binary, what would you call your, call your people then? We oh, just call God. it the sector. That's all we call it, but no, we under, no. but we, but we understand. I know, but we understand that it does need a title, so we just got we just saying, yeah, fine, call us the Umar Johnson section. Yeah, oh, okay, just all right, right. But the misconception is crazy, though. Well, it, yeah, but you got to help us out, though. I hear you. I'm trying to. I'm no. trying, but you know what I seen yesterday on <laughs> Olivia the Oracle's channel is don't nobody want to really listen. It's one, what it's do one you thing mean? You leave, it's, one, it's one thing you're leaving out, though. When, when they started that interaction, see, this is kind of disingenuous because she didn't know. She didn't really know that he was. She thought that she might have been on a. Hold on, a MBK. Of, hold on, hold on, MBK. Uh -huh. Sheffy, whenever we talk, I had to mute you. Whenever we talk, there's feedback coming from your uh from your phone. I'm just wanting okay. to let you know that. Okay. I understand. All right. I All right. Go ahead. It. Go ahead, MBK. So, so when they started the um, comp, when she was inviting him up in the beginning. 
She didn't mm. know that she knew him. She thought she might have been on a panel with him. So when she brought him up, she was, killing, crazy. he was killing him as the Umar boys. But then once he got up there, he said, yeah, you are. She said, wasn't I on one of your panels or didn't we do something? He said, yeah, you always come to my channel. Then she jumped on that. Oh, yeah, yeah, we know each other. We know each other. But she mm -hmm. wasn't on that time before he came up there. She was bringing him up there to get at him, to ask mm -hmm. him, why are you giving out all this money to Bree? And why are you doing this? But she Act. switched it up. And then tried to make it seem to Ness and them like she brought him up there because she knew him. That was Facts. a whole lot. That was but Facts. what was the other point, too, for the conversation other than money? Well, they were trying to figure out, uh, I guess, my story. They're trying to figure out who Shaquem really was. They're trying to see, like, what we really want from the beef sector. As if we can't, well, me personally, let me speak for myself. As if I can't enjoy content over here and want to be a part of it. Why can't that just be the end of it? You know what I mean? Why does it have to be this whole crazy he wants to take over type shit? Are you familiar with the China White, Brianna, like how they're kind of interact interconnected or you're not? I've seen her so, over uh, I've seen her over uh so, Rell's joint a lot. So she she she's aligned with Kimmy. So when the Kimmy okay. Brianna thing kind of happened, you know what I mean? Like so yeah, so she's aligned, she's aligned with her. And then she there was some talk, I think, with Brianna. Felt like she had something to do with that picture that was taken of her because, you know, yada, yada, yada. So so that's the whole thing. She's kind of aligned with Kimmy and, you know, Brianna and Kimmy are no longer. So that's how China White comes into this one. It's dealing OK, with OK. Hey. Now, now, check this out at the one what? minute and four second mark. Right. At the one minute. I mean, I think it's one. No, one hour and four minute mark. Olivia starts going in crazy. On Binary. Her. Can I say something? Mm -hmm. Can I interject? Yeah, go ahead. I really do also think. That maybe you need to talk up, talk to Brianna because remember Brianna cursed you out that one time because you asked everybody else a question but her right. Mm -hmm. I think it would be good that you would ask her what's going on with her and Kimmy and Olivia and stuff because those are almost her two like enemies, enemies. You know what I'm saying? Right. I mean, yeah. I mean, if she wants, I can ask her about those things. But right now, all I'm doing is I'm making assessments based off of what I actually see, which is cool. Okay. Instead of, where's instead of uh, where's that echo coming from? The echo's gone now. I think no. it's actually gone. I just, I yeah. was just talking. Unless no, it's your not. phone. It's not. I was. I, it sounds good to me. I'll case. go on me right now. Oh well, it sounds good to me. But uh, yeah. So at the one one hour and four minute mark, uh, the oracle starts going in on Brianna. I'm curious why she doesn't really like Brie. What am I missing? Why doesn't she like Brie? They have a long standing beef. It's a history, yeah. Mm. That's why I said, yeah. Should I ask? At the one yeah. hour and 13 minute and 45 second mark, they start talking heavy about money. And uh, Ness picked this up that, and, and I think you just said it too, Sheffy. The underlying thing is money. Where's the money flowing? Yeah. And that's really why they wanted to corner Darrell and jump his ass. They lined his ass about. up. It's yeah, also about, about money. It's also about content too, right? Like, you mm -hmm. know, a lot of people just watch Ness and Brianna, like, right? And I do think that they are trying to control the platform as well. And even you and BK, you know, uh, mm -hmm. they try to control you as well. So, no, whoa, I'm, did Tesla, I'm did Tesla babe get a uh, time? Come on, you guys, stop that. Yo, she's a member. We can't time out members, y'all. That's crazy. How do you feel they control me? Come on, y'all. Or on. no, let me go try to make or no, right. how about this? Maybe you uh panel happy. Panel happy? What are you talking about? Well, at first you never hit panels, now you're hitting a lot of panels. What what panel have I hit besides this one? I've been on this panel one time and just what happened with Sassy. What what other uh -huh. panels are on? I think I jumped on Brianna's channel to answer questions. Anti velocity. Yeah. Okay. I, they were talking about me for uh, for a whole hour. Well, I'm just saying, jumped, don't say that you don't get no I'm panels. Just, that's three panels. I, excuse that's me. three times excuse three me. panels. Okay, so now it's three times versus none, right? You sound you sound crazy. Let's move along. Like, what are you talking about? You don't there, uh, panels, Tesla, like, you, you should be good. Thank I don't think I said a bad thing that. about you. Just Come saying on, that you do hit panels now. All right. That's Chester a good thing. Be good now. That's crazy. How in the world y'all timing out members? 
But I'm also I trying to tell you, MBK, I, that people are looking at. Excuse, no, MBK, I'm, not, I'm really not. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on. Come on. Who's bro, first? This is what you want, bro. Like, you, you, like what do you, how, how do you think this is going to go? Is this the only way it's going to go? Like, it's not going to, like, <laughs> I don't know. Go ahead. Go ahead, uh, MBK. Finish your thought. No, all I was saying was, Sheffy, so you understand my. I don't know what that echoes about. My desire is not to hit panels. I'm just a viewer that does commentary. That's it. I'm not part of the beefs. I'm not part of the spectrum. <laughs> but I'm doing commentary. That's it. Right. All right. Riri, Riri's getting upset. <laughs> yeah, trust him. me. We got we got yeah, time. Let's go we got the time. Time. Let's no, we got time. We got time. So so money is the underlining thing that I'm starting to see. Now at the one now, remember, I'm I'm going over. Olivia the Oracle's last live that she did with D. Darrell's name in the title because that's important because they want to talk about titles and names being in titles and all that other stuff. You know what I mean? So, so we gotta we gotta she, she, address that. She admitted though, she admitted on Treasure Lane that she doesn't mind, you know, doing commentary on other people. She's gonna do commentary on who she wants because of YouTube. So whether she did commentary on him back then or not, she said it's cool. Everybody should be able to do commentary on everybody. Right. And you have to remember, though, that this is somebody that's saying, uh, yeah, the door it doesn't coincide. Right. It doesn't coincide with what her belief is, right? She's saying one right. thing versus another. She Sheffy, you should go out and come back in. Your mic is crazy. It's making me. Hey, Binary, yeah. do you hear me? It's good for me, though. I don't okay. know if it's the phone. Yeah, I think it was good for me, too. On. Okay. But 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 whenever you guys do interact, though, I do hear it. But whenever Sheffy and I interact, I don't hear it. So I don't right. know what's all right. And, and because I'm a, I'm a I'm a I'm gonna go down. out and I'm gonna come back in. You hear me? Okay. All right. All right. So let's just go to if we go to the one hour twenty seven minute mark at thirteen seconds. This heat decides she wants to drop that pedo stuff on Shaquem. And and when she does it, they just eat that shit up like it's just the gospel truth. That's something I can't stand. It's wild how loose and free people are willing to put a jacket on somebody over here. That's the thing that's wild to me. What's up, yeah, friend? So, Hello, so everybody. That, so that so that that's actually how it goes down as far as roasting and all, right? Mm -hmm. They fly roast, put jackets on people, right? So that so that's what I was telling you in the beginning. When you were asking me about how that how you might fare with the other stuff that you were dealing with, whether it's right or wrong doesn't matter. If you give the trolls any kind of red meat, they're gonna run with it. Right, right. Yeah, President Jesse Cat uh, thirty one is here. Um, shoot, unbothered for real is here. Thank you guys for being here. If I missed you for coming in, please forgive me. Uh, y'all hey, see that? Y'all see that? Sheffy and NB. Yeah, we hear you. We hear you. We see that Sheffy and NBK going at it, even though Sheffy loves her some NBK. So I don't understand what's going on. Angie is here. I do. I just think that he's wrong Kev all the time. Here. Gag Nation's here. So, so bomb. Molly, thank you guys so much for Dr. showing Binary. up. Dr. Binary. I heard you. I heard you. I heard, you. Just I heard sure. you. I just chose to ignore it. I chose to ignore it. Damn. <laughs> so, <laughs> damn. so maybe, um, maybe uh, that's damn. why these content creators... Maybe that's why they don't like Ness or King Roman or Bree mm -hmm. or Lemon or others because those choose. people are not quick to put a jacket on somebody and they actually listen and they actually listen to find out what's really going on. I mean, if this heat could just go up there and drop that on Shaquem and they're like, ooh, ooh, really, really? It's well, like, damn, it's, man. It's the same thing like Jay Dunn did the day before when she went around making up the story. They, they, don't, right. they don't like the situation. That's clear. So anything that comes about, they're gonna jump on. Like that's damn, Sheffy, what? they are complaining about your mic. Damn. Okay, it. can you it. can you not hear me though, by name? No, I can. Yeah. So I don't understand what's distorted. going on. It sounds distorted. Everybody else is echoing. I'm echoing. I don't right know. Now. I don't think I trust you no more. <laughs> okay, binary. What you say? I said I said it sounds good, but I don't know if they start if they keep complaining. In the chat, then we'll do something about it. Uh, but yeah. I don't understand it. <laughs> NBK, all right. Um, All right, so so there's that, and also at the uh, damn, it, it was yeah. See, oh, Lolo said it sounds good, so I don't know, man. She she um, should have stayed up here. She helps. Yeah, she helps with the content. Um, how about China White at the one hour fifty three minute and thirty second mark? She says 
that uh that we should be that we me and Shaquem should actually be questioned. She's yeah, like, we should be questioning so them. She's and I'm so like, bro. I'm like, okay, if y'all should be questioning us, why not let us on the damn panel? That's the weirdest shit ever. Hey, she, she's not hey even I part apologize of for Vincent. Stuff it still, it still sounds the same. I mean, I know they. I'm not even gonna care, uh, chat, uh, chat rep. Some people um, in the in the so just not are saying you're doing good. Yeah, okay, so. awesome. Let's just go forward. What's the next topic? No, we're not doing <laughs> next topic. We're staying. Damn, on okay. Topic. What's the same topic? Yeah. So China White says that Shaquem and, and myself, we should always be questioned, but they wouldn't even let us on the panel to be questioned. What is that about? Depending on the panel, too. Yeah, which is which is insane. They 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 were put putting the bat signal out for Dieterell to come over there to not only talk about why is he spending money, but to talk about me and Shaquem. I, it's just weird that we're in the damn chat. We're in there, and we're not even being disrespectful. That's the weirdest thing ever. And they would not ask us questions. It's strange to me. But you know what, binary. Here go the part that they always say you gotta do your history, right? Mm -hmm. Um, some people fuck with each other more than others, right? Um, you know, Kimmy and Brianna is on two different fields, and so is Olivia. Maybe not two different fields, opposing fields, right? Mm -hmm. Um, so you have Brianna versus Kimmy, Brianna versus Olivia, Brianna probably versus China White just because she fucks with Kimmy, right? You have Brianna versus, um, or actually Brianna and the Umar boys, right? Because I feel like you guys are more on Brianna's side than the opposing side, right? And mm -hmm. what side is winning right now? Uh, I mean, if you Brianna. let me tell it, Brianna's side's winning if you let me tell it. <laughs> yeah, so it's like, like should y'all yeah. really be mad? Like, fuck them. Right. Uh, a brother of a certain age says, Pedo and Snitch seems to be the jacket that people on the internet play with loosely, and it's loosely. very dangerous. I don't know why they do that, man. And if you listen to D. Durrell's explanation of the situation, it does not even closely put Shaquem in well, that jacket. Well, he did bad, though, because when he had the opportunity to say no, he kind of left it open and hid behind his yep. job. And that's because he doesn't like Shaquem. So he did right. leave it open, unfortunately, for them to keep speculating. But he did tell the story. And unfortunately, they're not listening to hear right. shit. Right. Like, they're not listening to hear shit. I don't shit. think they do their own research like they tell you to do your research. That's what I said in the beginning. They always <laughs> keep saying, research, history, history. But they don't research. even know who you guys are. They said that you came from Brianna, but I said that you guys came from Lemon. That's what I yeah, said. Yeah, it's crazy. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. But I don't I don't mind because I don't care if they do their research or not because it's all about what's going on right now. Eventually, the history will slowly start revealing itself as you continue to make waves. You know what I mean? The like, history... I don't have time to sit back and just start listening to, like, lives from four years ago. Like, I don't have time to do that shit. People will correct yes. me and I can listen. Like, when if I say something wrong and they correct me, I can actually listen. The problem is, is other people can't do that. They cannot do that. They can't freaking listen. So, so go ahead. Right, and that's Sonya, the crazy part. Um, Binary and MBK. Even hold on, hold on, hold on. MBK, you were saying something about Sonia? <laughs> no, I was just saying, Sonia has it right. It's, it's, the, it's the tactic <laughs> to run people off. Mm, right? To run people off. Okay. And what were you saying, Sheffy? You right about that, uh, MBK. I can see that. What were you saying, Sheffy? Hell, I was there. Then I, I got a little misconstrued. I said, "Sonya, who is Sonya?" Oh, uh, right, my bad. Yeah. So, so just be, so Dieterell actually hits the link at the one hour and fifty four minute mark and forty seconds. So they were going in, formulating their narratives, formulating their opinions, formulating mm -hmm. what they think are facts for two hours before ODS is here. Was good. Uh, sure, good to see ODS. you. Yeah, two hours. So there was nothing uh, D. Darrell could have said to let them change their mind about anything. Their minds have already been made up. It, it is crazy because you see it in real time. Like he's telling them things that are contradictory to what they're saying or contrary to what they believe. And, mm -hmm. uh, and they will not switch their minds up. Bree is here. But you know what, Cole? I actually think that's a power. Hey, Brianna. Good morning. Still great. I actually think that's the power. When somebody says they don't want you on their platform, don't go. Go where you tolerated this and the third. 
Facts. Look what happened. I really just want to say this, right? Go ahead, Bree. The the thing is, right? They was not paying attention to anything that was going on. And if you really want to look at it, it's really given that D Lo dead leg Olivia was sent. Like it's mm -hmm. like they sent her on a mission and she's making all the wrong mistakes. Like last night, I don't know if y'all seen the way that bitch got son. Like after I cussed her the fuck out and mm -hmm. BS on there, asked her one question, that bitch slipped out the back door. She like say by like the wind just got knocked out of her because I already had laid that bitch out and then VS just came and asked her one question and she basically had to admit that she using y'all to come at me yeah, like yeah. she basically had to admit that shit and it was like you know you're dumb right because if you would have just had a conversation with people you are basically choosing a side for these people because they're on my panel but if you would have just got to know them. They wouldn't have had an issue with you too. Right. Right. Like, Y'all really closed out a group of people because of who they associate with. And it's just like, it's just, it's just absentee for me. Is that the way I use it? Is that I, the way yeah. It sounds good to yeah, me. Okay. I just want to make sure it's just <laughs> absentee for me because China white, not even beef sector at all. She's not even, Damn adjacent she's completely black sector so for her to be sitting on a panel talk about somebody need to be questioning bitch question your pussy that's what the fuck is. <laughs> and then for olivia to ask anybody any motherfucking thing you supposed to be a married woman but all you're doing is hanging out with sluts Damn. can you slut try to fuck on married men China White fucking on a baser. So what the fuck is y'all talking about? Questioning me about what men around me when every nigga around y'all is questionable. Like, <laughs> right. Shit. God, God. And why is somebody trying to uh, have me be? You see that Kev H uh, thing in, in the background? Yeah, I see her. I see her in the chat. Why, I mean, why is they trying to say I'm okay with the R word and all that? I don't get it. I don't know. You got to clean that up with them, uh, Chef. No, nah, I ain't cleaning that shit up. I ain't never said nothing about the R word. That's Bree. crazy. Yes. Bree, you said something real interesting about how um, they, they if they would have been friendly towards the newer guys, like there would have been a situation there too. The, the beef sector should just look at like a lot of the smaller sectors and actually be looking for good content creators to bring in. It's just like a big company buys out a little company, right? When they're mm. when they're a good little company. Oh yeah, he strong. hates all the newbies, Brianna. Ooh. He said you're doing a horrible job, NBK. No, oh, stop. Come on, Sheffy. He's, <laughs> he's on a roll right now. He's he's making a good point. Yeah, no, go ahead, I, go ahead NBK. Yeah, so don't even, don't saying, even like, entertain that. If, if the beef sector it definitely is the big is the big thing when when you guys move around you should actually be looking at other sectors for good solid content creators that's why i connected to the to these umar dudes because i looked and saw they all cam up they all have good content solid channels so that's a good contribution to y'all's situation if y'all were to accept them you know rather than you know kind of like reject them just on face Right. And you know what's crazy is is a second, like two seconds before D Darrell hit that panel, China White was saying uh that we got ran out of our sector. That she you know just trolling, man. Yeah, we don't make man. content. I'm like, God dog, they don't do their history. And for somebody that has been to our sector, because I've seen her in D Darrell's chat a lot. So somebody that's been to our sector to go ahead and try to feed these narratives and to watch these people eat that shit up like it's right. freaking uh pho or or ramen noodles or some bullshit is hilarious to me. It's hilarious. Yeah, they want me. they want to believe it. it. They want to eat it up. I think that's a bunch of garbage. But keep going. What it sounded like to me, if if you want me to be completely honest, it sounded like you know, you know when you go to a, a concert, it sounded like they was trying to stamp tickets. Like, they're not even allowed to go watch the show. They just stand outside mm. back to see if you can get in or can't get in. And the whole time, those bitches not even in. Olivia right. had to admit last night, well, I'll do content on whatever the fuck I want to do content on. So then right. why the fuck are you questioning who people doing content about? Like, I don't understand it. Right. Right. Yeah. yeah. There's egg on her face. There's egg on her face. You know what I mean? It, because yeah. 
there's so much there's so many i love that live stream because the contradictions on their end are endless like like i said i have so many notes because of this bullshit and i'm not even pages. done I got two right <laughs> it's endless i'm like god dog. do they hear themselves do they it's, even hear themselves it's cool it's crazy because they they were they were saying all, all of the stuff that that i was saying that people were saying wasn't right old versus new you know the the, <laughs> the, 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 the uh treasure lane actually said i move around i'm in the clouds right mm -hmm, but he's mm -hmm. not hitting the panel that's exactly what i said and that's what you said which is crazy so so Ooh. when Dorel hits the panel first it was like two minutes before they even acknowledged him so you're gonna send out this bat signal and then you're just gonna ignore the man when he's on the panel <laughs> it's like what the hell right 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 but he, and did they bad, kept, he, he did well he did good and bad and they kept pressing him right it was wild because they kept pressing Dorel to give them more information about me when i'm right there they really think Dorel and I are working together behind the scenes, plotting to take over the B sector or some bullshit. Yeah, it's like, yeah. what? They told me I, when I was in the black sector, just because I offered a couple of like, you know, again, just tips to, to help situation, which was the last time I said anything, they accused me of trying to take over the black sector. That I want to monetize Man. the whole sector and have everybody working for me. Like, so that, that's just common shit around these parts. Yeah, yeah. At the two hour and 28 minute and 40 second mark, they're bringing up money again. Money is the common theme. It's crazy. I wonder why they're so upset that D. Darrell is actually supporting. D. Darrell is supporting people. Is it because he's not supporting them? Is that what's go. going on? There you go. That's no, guess what? No, because guess what? If they would have, if he would have sent it to anybody, if he would have sent it money, you see how it didn't matter that he sent money to Ness. Mm. It only mattered that he sent money to one person and the amount of money that he sent. And then for Olivia to say, no, I'm sorry, let me be respectful. For dead leg Olivia to say, <laughs> oh, I didn't ask about no money. I didn't ask about no money. For us. So what was your intention behind sending that money? Right. 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 Oh, my gosh. That was good. Now I know Sassy. I know Sassy's your moderator, but I have to talk just a little bit because I have a gut feeling Sassy and I are going to be going back and forth pretty soon here. The two hour and 58 minute mark in 20 seconds. Sassy says that I'm trying to force the swinger party story down people's throats. What the fuck? He says anything. He just says anything. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, well, I don't understand it. People are asking me about that. I want that story to go away. I want all three of these stories to go away. I'm not forcing this shit on anybody. Case in point, Sassy brought up the kids as bait story. Right. So she brought that up just like everybody else keeps bringing up the swinger party story. I'm not bringing this shit up. People are bringing it up just like she brought up the kids as bait because she's interested in the story. I'm not hating on people for bringing up the story. I mean, you hear me at a swingers party. Uh, you, Of course, you're going to want to know what the hell that's about. She's hating on, on people for doing that and saying that I'm trying to force that shit down people's throats. MBK, yeah, you want to speak on that? Yeah, she, she clearly is one of the ones I'm talking about when I talk about the people who yell be sector the loudest and have the least contribution. They asked mm. her the other day on the show on Lemon's panel, what is your contribution? And she never answered it. And she and like, why wouldn't you answer that? No, what she but, said was she wasn't going to explain what she contributes to you. That's what she said. Yeah, but why wouldn't she answer that? Because she didn't want to answer to you. But but when you jump up there telling people who they are and are, and when you can't, like, don't she, don't you at least owe them that to let them know? Okay, I can't. You said I'm not in. So what is your contribution? I think what she said was that she wasn't going to argue her position with you, which I... No, no, not me. I wasn't up there. I was watching it. She was talking to, to the Passport Boys and Lemon. Oh, uh, I thought she's... I thought... Who she told she wasn't going to argue? So, to, with so, me. I know she said she wasn't going to argue Well, she me. said that about me, too, when I came on your panel. Mm. But when I... But I'm talking about on Lemon's when it started. They were asked... She was telling... You know, because she goes all over telling everybody they're not part of the beef sector. So she was doing that over there with the passport guy, you know, her usual thing. And Lemon kind of went off a little bit on her and asked her what was her contribution. Yeah, and then Lemon the guy even was asked. asking her what her contribution was. They both asked her. And she refused to answer it. I mean, I would give my contribution if I had any. 
I would be happy to tell what my contribution was. She couldn't tell because she doesn't have them. I know that's your, I know that's your moderator, but just like yeah. people talk about CX, I take it. I don't go jumping to defend everything. I'm just keeping it a buck. No, I just thought that she, I was only speaking from what I saw. I don't know nothing about that exchange. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right, at the three hour, one minute mark of 35 seconds, Olivia, Olivia the Oracle tries to pin everything on D. Darrell. She oh, says oh, that. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> you really wrote down the time steps. Hell yeah. <laughs> because I would be playing the clip, but uh, damn all that. Hey, yeah, I'm taking notes from Shock Him. I ain't playing shit. <laughs> I ain't playing shit. <laughs> but yeah, at the three hour, one minute, 35 second mark, Olivia the Oracle tries to pin everything on D. Darrell. She is saying that he knows better and he should not have allowed. She said, D. Darrell, you know better. You shouldn't have allowed this to happen. That's cool. What? That's cool. That's cool. But then he came up there with the whole Godfather thing. You know what I mean? So. He said he was the godfather of y'all sector, so she's looking at him like he can control it. Now, if they were following along, uh, Hoodie is supposed to be the godfather of the sector, not D. Darrell, if they were following yeah. along. But they're following the bag. They're following the bag. They're following the bag. Absolutely. Right. D. Darrell has no authority or control over grown ass people. Stop, you guys. Go ahead. Uh, if you ask a question that's totally off topic. Mm hmm. Why you didn't tell me that conscious energy looked like CeeLo Green? <laughs> <laughs> Built like, look like he does. Yeah, you right. You right. right. Yeah, that was funny, though. That episode was funny. <laughs> Peace and love, family. Peace and love. Yeah, that's funny. Three hours, six minute, 15 second mark. Sassy clearly shows that she's pocket watching D-Darrell. And it's sad because she brought up this money situation first. And when D Darrell kind of checked her a little bit on it, like, damn, why y'all pot? And she's like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not though. But you are, cause you're bringing this shit up and you're constantly bringing it up. I don't understand why she is so fixated on where this man spends his money, especially if she, if he's spending his money on you, Bree, like, come oh. on. She should be happy about that. Go ahead. He said, uh, he, said he said, they said, you spent your, you gave money to Bree, I think. You gave money to Ness. They named some names, and they left one out. And then one of them said, hey, you "Oh, even you too. two cameras too." <laughs> like they, said, they are watching him. I'm like, damn. I said, yeah, that was interesting. That was yeah. Interesting. And just Kimmy, like, oh, oh my gosh. Oh, I am so <laughs> glad that Lemon didn't say, "Yo, go check out just Kimmy, yo, go check." <laughs> <laughs> she would she would have probably welcomed you like if the slate was clean and then you would have been hanging so, out over there and she would have just been telling all of them to kiss her ass and y'all would have been rocking with her. Yeah, it would have been a totally different situation. Oh, okay, okay, because damn, she's upset with D Darrell because D Darrell doesn't have extensive knowledge of me and Shaquem and why we're and why we want to be a part of the B sector. Yeah, so I, I think she was just trying to follow him a little. Yeah. Mm -mm. Yeah, she was just trying to what? Just trying to pile on and be a part of it. What you think, bro? Oh, yeah, yeah. He doesn't have. He doesn't know that information. I I don't understand why that's so hard to to believe that D. Darrell doesn't know why Shaquem and I want to be a part of the B sector. Why is that so hard to believe, man? Listen, if y'all didn't have no association with me, Giselle wouldn't give a fuck about nothing y'all got going on. But y'all, not Giselle. Right, right, right. <laughs> just just big and bitter. Around there looking like she was sitting in the school desk, sitting on that motherfucking sofa. I said, what the fuck? Right. I'm pretty sure I mentioned, I'm pretty sure I mentioned all your sister's names, brother. <laughs> I don't not say names, brother. <laughs> fuck them bitches. Fuck all right. of those, kid. Don't fuck about none of them big, wide, oompa loopa bitches. Shit. All of them who are talking about I'm fat and every single one of them hoes big. All them hoes. Just fat and miserable. They so motherfucking mad. Anybody can talk about them, can fuck them. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's up, uh Demon So good to see you, superstar. Hey, uh, so um the reason why it's so hard for them to to believe that Darrell didn't formulate any of this is because they already formulated in their mind a narrative and false uh, false ass answers to their dumb ass questions. And because D Darrell is uh 
because of what he's saying is not fitting their narrative and it's not pushing their their false ass answers along, they don't like it. They don't like it. Like just Kimmy kept trying to troll him, saying, "Why every time we ask you a question, you like I don't know, I don't know," because the Negro don't know. <laughs> Were you there from the beginning of when they started the interview? Uh, yeah, yeah, but I didn't stay the whole time. Okay, you know what I mean? in, the, in the beginning, it felt like I don't know. It, it felt like he came there to kind of outshock him, but then he just. You know, got a little overwhelmed when he started giving you up and you know anybody else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He started throwing all of us under the bus. Yeah. That's okay. That's okay. I don't mind that. I don't mind that. Yeah, I, I saw that part. I saw that part. So, um, oh, don't mind throwing people under the bus. So he's okay with it. So I really want to get into this part, and then we can actually move into treasure because uh, we we might have some time. But I don't know because after I get into this, it might take a, a lot of time. And let's, side, let's note, side note, right. Code, right? We don't talk behind the scenes, but th there was a um, ceasefire broker last night with ZX. Oh wow! Yeah, with ZX, yeah, and, yes, and ZX, me, you and Shaquem. But you know, the part of the ceasefire was he was going to get off of y'all, and no more names and titles. But lo and behold. Like, <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> So, <laughs> I guess the ceasefire will start tomorrow. <laughs> I had no idea, bro. I had no idea. <laughs> and who brokered this deal? Shaquem? No, I did. Oh, you did? Oh, yeah. did you hit me? Did you Did you try to email me? Well, well no. I mean, you know. So how was I supposed to know this? Well, you said you don't check your email. So I, I don't. You know. I'm just saying, how was I supposed to know this? You, you wouldn't. You can't. So that's my point. Oh, okay. Okay. I get you. I get you. All right. <laughs> All right. But now you're letting me know. Yeah. So if we don't get to the segment, I may yeah. not ever cover it. Okay. If we don't get there, I may not yeah. ever cover it because of the ceasefire. Even though, nah, I don't want a ceasefire. I don't want a ceasefire. I don't want a ceasefire. Oh, not yet. Not yet. I don't want to see. I want to make this point because the point has to be made. So not yet. Maybe after this. What's what I said? Tomorrow. Yeah, okay, maybe after this. Yeah, okay. And then and then like maybe after this he might not want to cease fire either. Ah, <laughs> uh, you never know. <laughs> What's up, Shakya? Peace and Pan Africanism. Peace and Pan Africanism. Sun God. What's good, bro? <laughs> All right. So I want to end this segment with this. And I might even create an enemy. Just Kimmy made a complete ass out of herself <laughs> it was so bad if you go to the three hour 56 minute 19 second mark and hit play you are going to be mind blown because mm -hmm. man she was going in as if she was like like scholar of the year and shit i was like what the fuck like she was going in like man like she just knows everything about everything and she looked like a complete ass all right so like i said this is at the three hour 56 minute 19 second mark if you missed it and i think it goes on for a good five minutes of her looking like a damn fool what did she do what was going on at that point? All right, you got to get your popcorn ready if you're going to watch that segment for yourself because she started the conversation off degree shaming and university shaming as if she's some kind of superior. Uh, it was crazy. Stop, Brie. Stop, Brie. <laughs> she was trying to shame D. Durrell's accomplishments. She was doing that, but as she was doing that, all she was doing was showing her ignorance. This woman is ignorant. Now, I she know she started in law school at 45, so. She did what? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. What did she do? She said she was going to law school, child. A law oh. school, you got to take the test. What is the test? Oh, Lord, the bar. Oh, no, Lord no, no, Jesus. No, 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 the pretest, like the determinant, the, the, what is it, LSAT? Whatever LSAT. it is. Oh, damn. Just the, oh, damn. Like the SAT? <laughs> like, she didn't even take, like, this school, you don't even got to take that. They just accept you. Lord, help us. 
Lord help us. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So she was trying to shame him. She's like, this ain't no Florida in- International University, mother alpha. Like she was just going off. I'm like, what the <laughs> hell? So she yeah. was appealing to uh, the Oracle, mm-hmm. Olivia, saying that D. Durrell's video was titled, The Beef Sector is Striking Down Content. Now, if you guys can look at this screen, let me put it on the, let me make sure this shit is on it's the big comma. screen. It's a comma. You see all those commas? <laughs> <laughs> it's multiple commas. And I don't see where it says the B sector is striking down content. I don't see where it says that. It doesn't. It doesn't say that. Crazy. All right. As if D Durrell, they're saying this as if D Durrell was focused on the B sector striking down content. He oh. clearly isn't. That's clearly not the case. Commas mean something. And you don't have to go to Florida International or Southern Louisiana or Harvard to figure that out. All you have to do, just Kimmy, is pass the first or second grade. That's all you got to do to understand this title. That's all you got to do. I'm not being condescending. I'm not trying to shame like she was trying to shame. I'm not trying to do that. It's mind blowing, too, that she even doubled down. D. Durrell was trying his hardest to show her that there is a line of demarcation here. There's commas. He's like, if you would actually have watched, took just 26 minutes of your life before you made this comment and just watched the commentary, if you would have just watched a little bit of it, you will see that he's not even talking about the B sector. He's talking about Shaquem and Ray Triggs. These are titles, and he's trying to he's trying to very calmly tell her this. Like, look, these are different segments to my show. That's, are, what, are, I, that's what D. Darrell fucked up. He was trying to be calm about it. He was supposed to tell they ass right, up. right. He, he was, should have. He was that was to, crazy. He was and you damn right, Eartha G. There's nothing wrong with Flo- uh, FIU. I don't understand that. Go ahead, Bree. I'm sorry. He was supposed to pull a ZX on their ass and lose his motherfucking mind. He was supposed to dog walk all five of them hoes. Because I know it was only three, three mm-hmm. big bitches, but it really was six bitches on that panel. Dang. He was supposed to drag the fuck out of them big, fat bitches, ex- ex- excluding Sassy. But everybody else, he was supposed to tear their ass up. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he, he, Bree, would you agree? That, I, I think that the fact that he knew um, Olivia already... That kind of disarmed him. She she used as a kind of like. Yeah, I agree with that. He yeah, came that in thinking disarmed. it was going to be a, fr- a friendly then, conversation. Go ahead. But bro. then when I came on that panel, and when I came on this panel, and and he right and he finally put it together, like, damn, right. he finally gave her what she was looking for. That's all she wanted was to be cussed at. Yeah, sometimes mm-hmm. you got to give them what they want. You know what I mean. No, <laughs> Tracy, you fat too, bitch. Tracy, you over there shaped like a square. Shut the fuck up, ho. I say whatever the fuck I want, bitch. Damn. Now, Tracy, you could get cussed the fuck out too, you fucking weirdo. Damn. Now, you mind the business that pay you when you go buy you some motherfucking silverware, bitch, because you forkless too. Not forkless. <laughs> Not forkless. Shit. <laughs> No, no silver one for no so silver. You. What are you talking about? <laughs> you say she gotta use her fingers? <laughs> <Pretty much. laughs> That's crazy. You know what? You know what else is crazy is after D. Darrell tried tried his hardest to, to, to show her, like you're off with your read. Like this is weak. You're 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 making yourself look stupid. Uh she tried to go the number route because I think she realized, oh shit. Damn. And so she's like, why would I even watch your shit if uh, if you only got 471 views? Why would I even? So she tried to go that route to try to shame him because she knows she was looking dumb as hell. She knows she was yeah, looking dumb as hell. I think they both are looking kind of dumb because, you know, stupid is stupid. And then welcome beef sector with a, a African. I don't know. This is supposed to be like a pan-African flag or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, you so thirsty for the beef sector to come over there, nigga. So, you know, you kind of got to. I blame both of them, Kimmy and Darrell. Both of them can get it. Both of them can get it. 
Damn. Well, anyways, Kimmy, uh, Kimmy looks even more dumb on this one, and I'm not even caping for, or, or yeah, I'm not even caping for Dieterell. Kimmy looks stupid as shit because she kept doubling down and she kept tripling down and she kept saying, "Well, you said it wasn't in the title," and clearly, no, not clearly, clearly, it's broken down content. Clearly, he's talking about the B sector. Clearly, he's talking about another segment striking down content and then another segment of being envious. Uh, D. Miss O is here. Good morning. Yeah, that was a bad read. Good. Yeah, it, was a, it was a horrible read. I was not going to miss this. This worked the price of him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, I, and I'll, give you, I'll give you some time to speak on it, too, because I'm almost done right here. Um. Once she started number shaming, I knew it was over. I knew like she even knew it was over. She knew that she fucked up because she started begging the Oracle Olivia to take down the screenshot that she had on the scene on the screen. She's like, uh, can you please just go ahead and just take that down? Because we don't need to see these low numbers. No, we don't need to see them commas. <laughs> That's the problem. Just Kimmy, you don't want us to see those commas. And if she doesn't private that live, you are going to be forever etched into the history of the beef sector of being a dumbass, at least for that moment. At least for that moment. You may justify yourself eventually down the road of, you know, becoming a lawyer and all the things that you want to become. But for this moment, you look, you look dumb as shit, man. I'm sorry. You look dumb, dumb. I mean, real dumb. All right, that's all I got. Yeah, it's, it's it's um I don't I don't really say a whole lot about Kimmy because this gets into the history thing because we were all on the same team at once. You probably don't know that, right? Mm, I didn't She's know that. down with so I never really had a problem with her. So I kind of like I'm cool, I've been cool on her. Mm. Now, how that's my clothes spare no horses when it comes to me, motherfucker. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let's let let's let Bree let's let Bree go first. Go ahead, Bree. <laughs> How the fuck you ready. gonna give it? You you got something to say about everybody else, but you gonna shut up on her? No, nah, well, certain that. people, certain people, I, I I give commentary, but certain people, I you know, I get a little neutral on. I said what I said about her. The situation right. with Kimmy looked like she tried to involve herself, and she probably didn't have all the information. Right? She she jumped in and didn't kind of know all that was going on. That's and you said was. this was a bad bad read on her. It was part. a bad read. It was a bad yeah. read. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Go ahead, Demon. So, what was you finna say? I was just saying he don't spare no horses on me, so I was just confused why this particular stallion <laughs> didn't get dragged through the manure. But, uh, but you know, because I don't even come that cruel and harsh to people as they as she does, so I'm confused why that. I think it's a fear of her, which you know, my you know, uh, fuck that. You know, I thought y'all had nuts. I thought y'all was the one with nuts, not her. But I guess not. No, because I, I don't know what the hell you scared of all that talking. That talking don't even add up to shit. So yeah, I'm I, confused. I respect that. I, respect yeah, that. I did confused. send you I did send you prayer hands yesterday, Vima, so as a token <laughs> oh. of like, you know, trying to make Where up. Where well, yeah. was I yesterday where I needed prayer? No, 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 that's not what I said, Miko. I said I sent you prayer hands as like a gesture. Just a piece, like a piece. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm just saying what chat where was I in? I was when you were in shot, when you were in shot, Kim shot going ballistic. Oh, uh, uh, <laughs> oh, okay. Dang. Okay. Well, yeah, I didn't see the meeting at the Ponderosa and all that that they did yesterday and the call to action, uh, aka lack of content, lack of cash apps. But Damn. what? Um, but what I did see was it really was forced. And I was so surprised he handled them so respectfully. But he seemed to be a respectful guy. So I don't care about them him not cussing no woman out. I don't get off on that. But at the same time, I told him in the chat, and this is you'd be a fool if you go over there and super chat now, because that's all they want was to show. I thought, well, not I don't know about Olivia. I don't think she's motivated by that. But that's all she wants is for you to shut the fuck up, her fuck up, and cash up her. Then you're gonna mm. become so useful. Then does Dee Durrell have a wife? Because she does like married men. So I need to. Talk, I will miss Dee Durrell. Needs to be prayed and covered. Oh, and um, you know, because I'm all for wives. You know, team wives. So what I'm trying. Um, yeah. So I want to make sure that she's covered because this woman will take take your children. 
and try to kidnap them and steal their image and pass it around. And she will also take your man. And then she always has questionable vaginal diseases at their various moments as the age. Because he, he <laughs> to the emergency room with her as well. So I'm sure MBK remembers, you know, his former sister's pussy problems. So I'm, I'm anyway, gonna, I'm but, gonna do a and, and plead the fifth. God. Okay. Well, I plead the fifth, I plead the moxa ceiling, okay? So, <laughs> Antibiotics. I'm going on mute. That's where we are with Damn. that. And it's going to always be up and stuck for me with that bitch. So before anybody wants the cake for her, you better be careful because I have a fucking match for your cake too. Damn. I think that was a, 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 a shot at MBK right there. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, There's some people in the chat who want to get Bob. Oh, people in the chat. Okay, okay. Just God. Like nobody in this chat is on her side. <laughs> <laughs> like, no. Well, no. Kate was attempted to be had before I came up here. So oh, okay. Oh, okay, okay. Damn. Hey, oh, Miss TMO, God. we good, right? Because I really don't want no smoke with you. We good, okay? We good? Yeah, you you misunderstood <laughs> me yesterday. I wasn't mad right. at you. I kind of wanted to get your perspective on that. And you did say that at the beginning. I got the screen recording. I hate, I just get frustrated people tell me I'm making something up. Because I'm like, why would I make it up? You just made a casual reference to what you saw over at Jay Wilson's and you thought it was ridiculous and coonish. And I kind of wanted to get your perspective because we're on the same page about that. I was just reminding you, I heard you say my name real quick with the Jay Wilson thing, I said so, and it's funny how they bringing it up now because that's happened a year ago. They don't give a fuck. It's just content now. So I was just kind of curious about your perspective on the nooses and stuff. No, I wasn't even really mad at you. That was my first time even coming to your chat to have a conversation about that because when I heard you mention it, I was like, exactly. Like, come on now. They didn't have a problem with that. Like, but whatever. Oh, yeah. If I did mention you, I wasn't calling you a coon. I was saying that he's a coon. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, we good. Dang, yeah. you calling Jay Wilson a coon, oh, brother? Yeah, Lord Jesus. Yeah, yeah, Jay Wilson ain't got no content. Oh. That whole status that I put up was was really about lemon and sassy because mm. everybody was saying that. Because remember, it was the whole thing about you know uh, they should be canceled. Uh, they should be canceled if they dealing with Rico the brat, right? Mm -hmm. So Jay Wilson just got Rico the brat in his chat, like everything was cool. So I said, so is Jay Wilson gonna be canceled for having Rico the brat in his chat? Not knowing that they ain't really got nothing about him, like I'm just being shady as fuck. And he right. did a whole lot. She calling for me to be canceled. <laughs> and his chat had to check him, like you know what he did. He was just like, Oh, well, if he if he did that over there, then I mean he just can't do that over here. He could come over here, he just can't do that over here. Oh, okay, but but then but then listen, so the comments was. He can do whatever he want. He should be able to allow to have whoever he want on his channel. He could do whatever type of commentary he want. Mm -hmm. So why is it different for me then? Yeah, facts. I don't understand it. I don't understand how they will say one thing and then and then do the other. Like they will say, you know, they can do whatever they want on their platform. I'm only I'm only in charge of what I got got over here but then they will say why are they doing this why are they doing that why you know I'm like, <laughs> they're not standing on anything this, this, they're not this standing on back nothing. and forth there's nothing to it that that's why we're still here able to do what we're doing if there was right. really something to it we'd have been canceled but there's you can't really it. cancel nobody off the internet for real, you can't bro. cancel them but only they youtube still, they, they cancel us off of youtube they, when i say cancel i, I mean you mean. won't see all these beef sector people <laughs> in here i know what you mean speaking right. of cancel though did you know your friend channel got taken the same way the other man channel got taken? Who? Who's about Flacco? Yeah. Yeah, I saw that. I did a video on it yesterday. Wait, Flacco's channel's gone? The and same way the other man channel got taken the same as that way. I yeah. keep hearing y'all mention, I don't want to derail the show, but I keep hearing y'all mention Ripple, and that's interesting to me. That's like my biggest thing. Like, I'm part of XRP. That's been my thing for five years. So what i ask maybe another time. What association would they have with Ripple? I don't really understand. Oh, that. so it's like they channel get hacked and then they like run these commercials. Like they run this like infomercial and then like people flag it down for like spam. Okay, and so somebody's just using Ripple's content, I guess, to get them in trouble. But it's not actually Ripple's problem. Right, exactly. Okay. Yeah. okay. 
I wonder like, how they hack in these channels. I'm nervous now. Shit. It's weeks. Like basically, if you like, they'll send you like an email, and then you click the email, and it basically goes into all of your shit. Oh damn that! Yeah, but I, I think it's a way you can recover your channel. I don't know, but yeah, that shit's wild. Damn, Flacco oh, put in all that work, and his shit is gone. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be a, a long week for that nigga, but um. Let me just say this about Treasure Lane before I lose my thought. So okay. he, he said, um, I wasn't allowed on his panel because I'm not beef sector. But then, yeah, no problem letting glitter boots up there on the panel. Yeah, no problem letting glitter boots pour, write a four page letter to Brian last night and shit. So this just shows you that these people, they don't know what they want to do. They don't know if they want to accept us, hate us, stone us, crucify us. Like, they don't know what they want to do, but they're using, like, this fake moral stance, like, mm -hmm. you know, only the OGs can come over here when they let glitter boots up there, and then nobody say shit. So, as far as... Well, like, also, he said that he wouldn't let you up there because <clears throat> of the commentary that y'all gave about him. That's what he said, too. I've never spoken on him. I don't yeah, know. Who, what, was the, what was the commentary? What was him? the commentary, though? I don't understand. I guess the, whole thing, the, the whole thing of what Jay Dunn was talking about. Yeah, the evolution? He made that up. He was never the commentary. He was just used as an example. I pulled his name out of the air. I could have said anybody's name. It was never about him. Everybody else made it about him. And uh, had he have done his research... <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> had he have done his research instead of jumping to uh, assumptions and conclusions, he would have known that. But that goes to prove NBK's point: they're not really, really, really fucking with us. They're they're taking advantage, but they're not really fucking with us. You know what I'm saying? And it is what it is. Go oh, to ZX, I mean, not ZX, but the James Point. ZX been around for how many years? And he just was able to click his channel last night. Like, let's be for real. He persisted. <laughs> Like he's been around for five years, and that man just was able to click the link yesterday. Well, the right. point is, they don't consider him to be beef sector. That's my only argument. Yeah. So, if that's the argument you're going to make, you have to be consistent in your argument. Yeah, and right. not say, oh, well, I'm going to let ZX up here because, you know, VS is up here. VS isn't even considered beef sector, is she? Yes. Okay. She, is. she so, left, though, but she's. I've she heard. I've heard otherwise, but I'll concede that for now. But either way, what VS is what there would be <laughs> without VS. Like what? Like me and her don't get along at all. But we and, and she said she likes the Umar boys. So there you go. Yeah. Let me say. Let me say this, or let me ask ask this question. Uh, how much does uh Trezor typically get in his chat? Because 1.5k is a lot, but if that's uh, typical, you do numbers. Yeah, like one, one, like if it's like one, one k is normal for him. Damn. Yeah. So 1.5k was like <clears throat> that was a lot then. Mm, no, I mean he's gotten up to two before. Oh, he's gotten up to two. Okay, so this is just typical. All right. To be talking about nobody like us, that was a lot. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking because. Yeah. Well, that wasn't the first time. That wasn't the first time I was over there, but that was the first time I seen 1.5k. Is all I'm saying. I've never seen 1.5, but I've seen them at a thousand, eight hundred to a thousand, pretty regular. Question: Was he talking about y'all, or was he talking? Was he addressing his sector? Because I thought he was. No, he, he was, was talking about us. Sector, but everybody knew that this was precipitated by all of this nonsense with everybody saying we were going at it. So, like, that was the, the context of all of it. This new versus old, who you gonna let in? The Umar boys. Everybody wanted to see what he was gonna say. And his monologue was about us. Yeah, absolutely. You know well, what I mean? I was, live, I was live until I came over. Right. But, so I don't know what all was said. That's but a I, good point, RY made too. I think Tracy had the biggest show I ever seen. Oh wow. Yeah, she had a she had a double. Like two yeah, point so two, two point three or something. So why couldn't that we at least get a thank you? And I think the middle finger was his way of thanking us. Ain't nobody finna tell y'all thank you. <laughs> nah, you're not getting no thank you, bro. Like, come on. <laughs> now, now, now I believe you did say that you don't feel appreciated. 
It's like, come on, man. We you just used our name to run them numbers up, man. We can't even get oh, a thank Lord, you. Please don't I, get distracted. Let's not get distracted. The that's a motherfucking <laughs> lie. Like, no. Please, the main man. point like, is he said nobody that's not beef sector can get on the panel, and glitter boots was allowed to come up there and have a whole diatribe with Brian. So as far as people trying to make the argument. We don't want new people, no beef sector, and OG only. That's bullshit. You pick and choose who you want on your panel based on convenience, based on numbers, that based is. on how the conversation is that going. That makes sense to me. Go ahead. So, so, so they, would also, hold, on. hold on, hold on, hold on, MBK. Let Bree, oh, let Bree. Yeah, that. Go Are you crying? Oh, shit. <laughs> Go ahead, MBK. God damn. Go ahead, MBK. No, I was just saying that. It seemed like it was kind of like a... Um, situation where they happen to be talking about something. He, I think ZX had been back there and he wasn't going to let him up, but when they were talking about that specific thing, I think he wanted to bring him up to get that out of the way. I think that's right. And that, it, that can be, a, that can be believable because ZX yeah. has sat back on my back, uh, back thing, backstage <laughs> for a hot minute. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, this Negro's still here to the point where I had to kick him out of studio. So it's yeah, like, going, I just got hang. sick of looking at his avatar. And well, thing, you had glitter boots for your panel the other day too. So yeah, I'm, and guess what? I'm just making an argument. Baby and guess girl. what? Shaquem. And when they reminded me, I was like, damn, I fucked up. Shock him. The yeah. one thing I will ask, this, this is a good segue. I, that was the one thing that I actually didn't agree with last night. I thought that that was a bad move for you to try to hit the panel in the middle of all that when, when you guys were actually winning. I thought that that was, you should have well, not, you you're not tried to hit the panel. Like, there's no you're way you were going to get up there, but even if you got up there, like, what would you really say in the middle of all of that? Well, and I didn't funny. even want to hit the panel, just, yeah, just yeah, to you know. But go ahead, uh, go ahead, uh, Shaquem. Shaquem, your mic is a little low, so I'm going to have everybody kind of, so we can hear you. I'm not saying yeah. adjust yeah, anything. I just want to hear you. I'll be, in the, I'll be in the chat. All right, all right, Bree. Appreciate all you. Right. Thing. Okay, people make, just like the coon, Jay Wilson, made all of these <laughs> assumptions about me. <laughs> that I hate gay people and I hate black women. You, mm. you coon, shuck, dive, turkey, ass want to be pro-black one day, then the next day you want to pander to a racist-ass bitch. Damn. Don't ever assume that I cater to nobody. Why would you assume that I hate gay people when I have members on my channel that belong to the community? So that, that shit is disrespectful, and it's, it's wrong for you to try to paint everybody with a brush and say, oh, they hate gay people over there. Yeah, and, I didn't like that. Yeah, I didn't like that, that shit because I don't. I, like that. I don't. That's the I thing. Like I'm that. a I'm a freaking advocate and an ally. So that's the thing that I can't stand. But go ahead. Yeah, and they don't want to let anybody defend themselves or give any pushback. And that's also something I have a problem with. Facts. Because it's group think over there. It so is. That's the only 100%. reason I to get the panel. And I wanted to ask VS, why was she trying to set me up? So I had a couple questions I wanted to ask last night. Right, yeah, yeah they, they wanted us. Uh, Kenola, Kenola let me know that they wanted us over there so they can, uh, so they can uh, come at us a little bit, but in a friendly way is what he was saying. It wasn't going to be malicious or anything. The Kenola I, thing they was wanted, interesting. They wanted yeah. content. Go ahead, uh, go ahead, MBK. What you say? I was just saying the Kenola thing was interesting because he came up with a lot of fire on the first panel, um, over on Olivia, and then he came over to um, Nest panel. And he came like he wanted to bring the heat to D. Darrell, but once he got up there and saw D. Darrell was a cool dude, he couldn't even do it. He was like, damn, I can't do this, man. This dude is right. cool. Right, you know, right, because like, he found out for himself. And that's yeah. what a lot of people aren't doing. They're running with this heat style narratives <laughs> and thinking <laughs> whatever she says is gospel truth, which is crazy to me. And the, the, I will say this about Treasure. He didn't, he's not trying to formulate plans and schemes to outcast or ostracize us or excommunicate or shun us. That's the cool thing about him. He was like, just let it flow how it flows. Why are y'all right. trying to stop shit? So I, I really did enjoy his commentary and I really did enjoy his live last night because you know it, was, it was one of those real balanced, balanced discussions. Go ahead. No, I was just going to say, you know why he understands? Because he does the exact same thing on the Spiller Boy channel. He does mm. commentary on the show, which right. just like all the other millions of people on in social media, you watch something, you give commentary. That's it. Right. And you know, what's crazy. I'm, I'm not even going to hold y'all. 
I know that our time is limited, right? We're, we're the center of attention now, but that can never be sustained. And I think that's something you're talking about too, NBK. Our, our style can never be sustained. People will get they bored will. and they're going to move on. However, that doesn't mean just because the limelight leaves us that we leave. My hope is that when the limelight leaves us, we, we have settled in, if that makes sense. No, you're right. Yeah, that's and that's exactly what a lot of people yeah, and that's what a lot of people don't get. They think that I'm trying to keep this type of momentum up where I'm always the talk of the town. I've already told Dovey when she when she tried to hold my feet to the fire, I already told her all I want to do is be accepted so that I can make B sector content and not be harassed. <laughs> you know what, what, what I mean? What, what I just want to do my commentary. Go ahead. Go what ahead. if this happened, right? So there could be a lot of people that try to do commentary on the beef sector. And I've seen people do commentary and I've seen people be very disrespectful, do what they consider to be funny commentary where they might be making fun of the different types of people. So, so I understand their apprehension about people talking about it. But when you get people like you and I who are trying to do like real straight commentary, not disrespectful, just like real content, it's, a, it's the highest compliment. Because right. we, what we're doing is we're spending our time to totally invest in what they're doing to understand it and then come back and talk about it. And if this if this show ever did blow up or was big, who benefits? They do. Because right. now we get to push this show to thousands and thousands of people and they're going to want to know where is this content at? Who are these people? Right. right. That's how it's supposed to work. So if everybody from the B sector was supporting us and pushed us out into the hemisphere, well, when we get into the hemisphere, everyone's looking at more. their content. That's facts. That's, that's, that's facts. how it goes. Man, that's real too. And and I want to end this segment with this. Okay. I really think uh that this was a moment that the B sector is trying to stand in solidarity. They're the, especially the old heads. And I know you don't like me talking about the old heads, NBK, because you you do know the history. Most people try to say you don't, but you do. And you have your favorites, and most of them are old heads. You know what I mean? <laughs> but I, I have a gut feeling that they're thinking that the Umar boys is what they need to stand in solidarity against. Exactly. You exactly. know what I mean? It just can't happen because but, you know, how can you stand in solidarity when you have inner fighting like we just witnessed now? But yep. the thing to come and breathe, they was coming at you to come to breathe. And I'm yep. sorry, any they cannot like me all they want to because I'm I'm fine with being the middle child because the same people don't care for me. But my whole because they don't like the skin that I am and they don't like the fact that I got all this mouth to be as black as I am and I do. And mm. so my thing is this, like. I don't get how they think solidarity. Why would I stand in solidarity to somebody who's telling me that my skin color ain't shit and that I'm this and like a piece of shit and I'm black and I'm crispy and wow. that all these things about me and my life and all that. Why would the fuck would I stand in solidarity? I'm going to go to who treats me well. That has mm. nothing to do with being thirsty. Like I didn't like that shit. Even Sassy was saying, but I found that funny. She was saying it on the panel, somebody who be over here. Like mm. they be saying cash money shit to y'all, but then they be damn throwing bullets. They be hitting other motherfuckers. And I just love it when they have happens because it's so ridiculous because i'm like okay you saying this about a type of woman that be over here well you sitting on a panel about the type of woman you said be over here Damn. and i'm just like i'm gonna go where somebody is treating me nice like i don't have to do what y'all hold say I, I am down for the beast of the night i am going when it's time to slide i'll slide but on a but to a point because if you're mm -hmm. breaking me down i can't tell who's who at that point Breaking yeah. me down and not giving a fuck about my mental, physical, my devs doing fucked up shit to me when I'm burying my aunt last week. But you want me to stand in solidarity, you bitch? You must have lost your motherfucking mind. Mm. Like, why the fuck would I stand in solidarity to somebody when everything that is my essence as me, you tear down and don't mm. give a fuck? But then you want me to come st uh, stand in solidarity to you until you get the next super chat and then you're going to throw me back under the bus. Fuck you and fuck the goddamn ship you came in on. Damn. Are you part yeah. of the beef sector, Lee Mitchell? Of course she is. Well, I thought she was just saying she you doesn't that, 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 that is, uh, I'm not standing in solidarity with no motherfuckers who tear me down. Of course I'm part of the motherfucking beef sector. Don't question that.
Calm down, calm down. I'm just asking based off what you said. Did you just send the prayer hands? The black race? Are they are they niggas? Because I can't tell sometimes the way they race trade. So you want to go there? Fuck the beast sect, all. You a fucking nigga at the end of the day. No, no, I wasn't going anywhere. I thought you were saying you don't stand in solidarity with the beast sector. I'm in the beast sector. No matter how people try to throw that down to me, of course I'm in the beast sector. I'm, no, I'm, this I'm is what I'm saying. I'm why, why, why are they trying to trying to make it a stand in solidarity moment against the Umar boys? That's what it seems like <laughs> they're trying to do for whatever reason, and that goes against all rational and logical thought. Like if you think, and that's what T, uh, that's what uh, Miss, uh, that's what TMO is saying. Mm -hmm. If you think that I'm going to stand in solidarity over something like this, you're full oh, of shit okay. because okay. of what? Because of what? Y'all be doing to me. That's the dumbest shit ever. I've, she, she wants to go somewhere where she feels welcome and accepted. And I hope she does feel that over here because I do welcome you and accept you over here. I hope you feel that. Now, the thing is, the thing is this. The MHB thing, the most hated blogger thing there is where go. people should have been standing exactly. in solidarity. They, they dropped the ball on that thing. because they started funding that Negro and helping him dox people. They right. even got so upset that they were mad that he didn't even dox they ass. Like, where's my doxing? How come you didn't dox me? What the fuck? You know what I'm mean? like? Are you serious? Like, that's where the solidarity should have came in play. Not against us. We're, we're, we're an easy target. Right, we, mm. we get bullied, right? Because we, we no, they talk think crazy. we're easy targets. They think we're easy targets. Well, right, they, they, they feel we, and we technically we are, because if we mm. weren't easy targets, this would be a total different show. We would be coming mm. on this show, turning the fuck up, and we would be really addressing some of this shit. But we're trying to have an impartial, good show where we're not slandering, person going off crazy. You know what I mean? So, so we're trying to keep it cool. But if we, if we was really on timing. Oh, we would be up here getting it in, but but that's not what we're trying to do. Right. So Molly's saying I like the merge because I'm benefiting, or if you listen to me, I like the merge because I like the beef sector. Just saying. I mean, I've been on record saying that for how long now? Ken Nola is here. Let's see how much shit he want to talk. We got. Yeah, but you minutes. need to shut the fuck up from the chat because they don't even give you the goddamn yeah, benefit I, of calling you the, gen the gender that you want to be called. So take damn. your dick and shut the fuck up, then. Are you tracking oh, the fact oh, that oh, you go, that your goddamn grandmama don't accept who the fuck you are? Are you tracking the fact that you, uh, you gonna make them Hit the link. You go to uh, dinner. Are you damn. tracking the fact that you can't even be who you are to your people? So sit oh, the fuck down in Miami yeah. Popo. That ain't all I talk about. That's all the motherfucking shit that comes up. So I defend myself and y'all don't motherfucking like it. Who the fuck gonna check me? Oh, Ooh. damn. Mic drop. Shit. Lady Dimple's finna hit that damn link. Um, we only got like 13 minutes. What up, Ken? She better tape that Come dick. Come on, yo. fucking with me. Damn. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> you got something to add, kid? What's going on, man? You trying to line uh, us up, brother? You trying to line us up? Listen, this, cool. nah, this, this, this is good. Nah, this is this this is a good show. I'm be, I, I'm a troll. I'm I'm a troll. I don't know if they told y'all. All I do is troll. MBK. Listen, bro. No hard feelings, my brother. Know, bro. I'm know. just a yeah. I'm just a troll, bro. I I be talking my shit. I be saying what I gotta say. Now I do have a show later. That I'm gonna cuss the whole beef sector out. Nah, Hold on. Because when that man docks the socks off of them, they didn't stand. You, you just said it. They didn't yeah. stand together then. No. You feel what I'm right. saying? Right. They was giving that man information yeah. on each other. But now, since y'all came in the sector, not everybody want to try to stand together and <laughs> oh, we we so, <laughs> we solidarity. We this is the beef sector. Yeah. Oh, fuck the beef sector. Weird. Fuck it's the weird, beef bro. sector. Uh, because I like the beef sector. I like the beef sector. Nah, yeah. I, I, fuck them. Because nah, this, this is why I say fuck them. Because when I came in the beef sector and I was cussing women out. I was talking crazy. I was talking about kids. I was saying I was talking my shit. You know what the women in the beef sector was doing? Was Dragging doing? me for filth. Calling me gay. <laughs> bisexual. Oh, he must don't like black women. Oh, he must don't have a wife. His wife must be cheating on him. But when these fellas come in the sector, oh, and, and they're breaking off money. See, it's not about no uh, 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 y'all... Um, doing whatever y'all doing it's about the money they're not going to say these trick ass hoes ain't going to say it 
These money hungry bitches ain't gonna see it, so I'ma see it. These hoes getting that money from y'all, and they enjoy getting that money from y'all, and that's why the fuck they doing what they doing. Because guess what? If y'all wasn't giving them no money, MBK, I bet you any money that they'll be dragging y'all for field, and y'all wouldn't even be in their chat. Damn, I don't. And I can't I agree with that. I can't agree with that. I could, cause I was, I was in this chat in in their chat before I started giving money, and they were right. cool. You know what I'm saying? And I started, I started giving money because they were so cool and everything was chill. And with the whole Umar thing, they was holding them down. Mm -hmm. You know. No, well, so, well, Ness is different. Ness gonna, Ness gonna invite anybody. Ness gonna yeah. invite anybody. Listen, if y'all disagree, I understand y'all. Y'all always talking about y'all disagree with something. Y'all know good damn well I'm telling the truth. Y'all know disagree. this damn well. I'm Barn telling dog you. Barn dog disagrees. They always mm -hmm. talk about they disagree, but I, I guarantee. And, and as far as the uh situation with Trey right, Jones, Bree is here. Bree is here. Go yeah. ahead. Yeah, Ken. Yeah, I don't need you to put a name on that. Who 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 the hoes you talking to? Oh shit. All oh, y'all. Well, that's a motherfucking lie. Because when you first came around, you was in my motherfucking chat. And me oh. and you got into it. And that's why we the fuck fell out. I didn't give a fuck about none of this shit you did. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Cuss me out. This All right, cuss me out. Go ahead. Right, go ahead. Cuss right, me out. Right. So watch your motherfucking <laughs> mouth when it come to me, nigga. So, I, I cuss me I forgot. So, so take that shit back when it come to me and talk about everybody the fuck else. <laughs> you right. right. I, you right. You right. I forgot. I forgot. I take that back. Uh, all right, Bree. Damn. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, Cause yeah, me and Bree. Yeah, we went the wall. I ain't gonna lie. We went the wall for a, a year straight, and she was tearing my ass up. But damn, Ken, you didn't. You didn't even stand. You didn't even like even try to combat that. Not even I couldn't, a little bit. couldn't, bro, because she had me, bro. I I couldn't. <laughs> yeah, I, I had to take my L. She had Damn, me. She was tearing At least try up, to throw off her, throw off her game a little bit, brother. You know, nah, you try know to make Bree, her doubt bro. her. Try to make her doubt what she remembers. You know, what I mean? Bree gonna debate the hell out of you, though. You already know how she is, bro. She gonna debate you. And Shaq Kim, bro, it's no hard feelings towards you either, bro. I just like to, I just like to have fun. It, it's just, it's too much doxing going on. It's too no, much, thanks. you know. You feel what I'm saying? It's too much people playing with people, family members, no, that's and. Real. Uh, and all that, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So I'm just not with that. But far as the uh the thing that oh y'all shouldn't take that serious with Trey Joy and uh ZX. Let me tell y'all about that. Okay, and, and 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 I know and this is a, this is a fact. He didn't let y'all up there because y'all are straight men. Y'all are y'all y'all strictly straight men. <laughs> ZX, listen, watch, just follow, follow me. ZX. And Brian have a history of <laughs> allegedly <laughs> flirting with each other. Damn. Allegedly. Now, Damn that's no what he let him up that's there. The no, I'm dude. telling you, bro. You ain't <laughs> telling me nothing. No, no, I know you're crazy. <laughs> hey, MBK. <laughs> hey, hey, Ken, you got to catch what MBK said. He just dropped a <laughs> nugget. He that's said, MBK. you don't need. Hold on. Hold on, Ken. Listen. <laughs> He I said, hold on, MVK. Let me okay, say it. Hold on, okay. hold on. He what? said there ain't even no allegedly. So you could say that without even saying allegedly, brother. They was flirting with each other. That's what MVK said. You <laughs> for real? Ken, just so you he just know, said Ken, it. Ken, just so you know, Cold and I met kind of same way you and I have met. I can't yeah. to get on him about trolling. So, yeah. so, so he's comfortable jumping on your side to troll me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You did y say that, though. Gonna, you did say that, but go ahead. And I'm going to answer <laughs> Gag Nation together. Yes, they have a history from what he said. Yeah. Ryan was upset about his family. He let him come to the platform to, to voice it. And that's it. And then right. they all ran with the rest of them. That's yeah. It. Simple. Jessica, I mean, yeah. just took a clip of that, uh, by the way. <laughs> Just to let you know that you said we don't have to say allegedly when we say that Brian and uh, ZK had a relationship. Well, I, 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 I had to say that to protect uh, Cold Platform, you know. No, I appreciate that, but NBK, let us know the truth. So you know the ceasefire is over now, right? We know we're just going to ceasefire out. Right? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I don't have time to get into it. I don't have time to get into my last segment, which is okay. I don't mind that. Um, and if there is a ceasefire, I don't even need to ever get into it, but. I just need Beasley to know something. That's all. But 
I don't know. Beasley. <laughs> yeah, I need, yeah, but I don't have time today. No, no, no next time. show. We yeah, next show. Okay. Okay. He yeah, probably around the corner right there. If you give him some crackers and some wine, oh, uh, probably I, give him some a gallon of water. He he appreciate it. Home. Listen, I went to his live last night and about died, bro. I about died going to his live last night. He was eating some cherry sours, <laughs> smacking and shit. I couldn't even take. I couldn't take it no more. I couldn't take it no more. I'm like, yeah, I'm like, bro, what are you doing? What are you eating right now? Y'all gonna get Beasley out of retirement? Keep on fucking around. Know, what, what, right? what, what what are you gonna do? Who who are you gonna? He can't. I, don't know, fuck I might with put me. him back. I probably put him on my payroll the way things looking right. I like you. He I can't like you. fuck with me. Oh damn. For you. All of that, that first of all, my wife is secured. That ain't going to work. I'm secured. That ain't going to work. And whoever, he could play with the fuck the family member. All they're going to do is cuss his turkey neck looking ass out. Damn. All the rest of that ain't going to work over that. That doxing shit, I done been doxed 38,000 times. What he need, they talk about liposuction. He need to go get liposuction on his fucking neck. That's what he need to go do Shit. before he talk about anybody. He can't out drag me. I would drag the fuck out of that greasy hair looking ass nigga looking like he got seven bottles of moose on his fucking head. Man, that man can't fuck with me, man. Good Lord. Bitch yeah. ass nigga. But anyway, you guys have a wonderful day. That's that schizo came, man. You know, you got to watch it sometimes. <laughs> All right, Kim. We appreciate you, bro. We appreciate Thank you. Thank you for letting me up, brother. Uh-huh. Yep. That's Ken Nola coming in uh, talking dude. talking his shit. All right, Demon. So well, give us your you final gonna, word. Are you gonna go uh, kiss the ring um, like they want you to today? Who? They want you to go over there and kiss the ring. So you are gonna go over to Just Kimmy's and go kiss the um? The, the I am not the going to no Just girl? Kimmy's. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm gonna say because you kiss that ring, your mouth might turn green. Anyway, Damn. have a good day, Cole. All right. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> shit. Wow. I got a question. Um, uh huh. MBK Ness said that I don't know if you talked to Ness yet, but she said, Hey, she want me to be her co host. She doesn't need a thousand dollars, nigga. So, is that what the fee is? Huh? Is that the fee? Yeah, is I don't know. Yeah, for a thousand. So, I don't know if you talked to her or not, but uh, I'm working on you know, I'm working on it. I'm working so, on it. So, so I sent I sent Ness messages through Cash App. <laughs> so, I told, so, the last Cash App message did say. Shakim 2024 co-host, but now I have a price. So now I need to know what the tenure is for a thousand. You get two years out of that, four years, one year. Dang, what, she said, she said you're you lying, Shakim. She said you're lying. That's crazy. Oh damn. Shakim. I'm not lying. I just talked to her last night. So 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 just just so you all know, um Shakim. Is Code and I are going to be Shaquem's uh, campaign manager, and we're going to be starting this campaign up, which is Shaquem for Nest Co-host 2024. So we're going to work with him. So I'm going to need some we're, cash apps because I'm not gonna, trying to. My budget gonna, ain't going to cover it. I'm going to pay Code. <laughs> I'm going to pay Code. We're going to work with him. We're going to work with Shaquem. We're going to give him to stop saying bitch. We're going to make him much more beef sector friendly. And he's going to go on all these speaking engagements at the different channels, and we're going to vote him in. As a co-host, and that's what we're about to do. So we need your support. Thank you. Okay, so I got to go through media training. I get it. I get <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's facts. Yeah. <laughs> you definitely yeah. got to go through some we're media training. Very much <laughs> more be, be, such a friend. be wearing your heart on your sleeve too much, brother. All right, MBK, <laughs> thanks for coming up, bro. Give us your All final right, words, man. All right, that, those are my final words. Oh, damn. That's it. That's it. <laughs> no, okay. no. Actually, final, final words is good show. Salute to everybody. Appreciate the support. Um, that was a great show by Treasure Lane last night. I enjoyed yeah, seeing all the OGs. And you know, hopefully this will all blow over and, and the beef sector can start to look at us as an extension of them and support yeah. what we're doing because what we're doing is, is to try to help them and us in the long run. That's facts. It. Appreciate right. you. Yep. Those are facts. Well, Shaquem, you ready, bro? I think I got you all uh, redirected and everything. Yep, I'm ready. I'm going to be um, doing something different today. So I'm not, if, if the numbers drop, it is what it is, but I'm going to try something different today. So. Ah, shit. Hey, man, you can't get better if you don't try, try, uh, try different things, man. You know what I mean? So, yeah. all right, give us your, give us your final, your final words, brother. Yeah, I just hashtag um, Shock Him Ra for Ness's co host 2024. Hashtag Shock Him Ra for Ness's co host 2025. 
and hashtag Shock and Rock for Ness's co host 2026. Take that. <laughs> take that. Take that. All right. Peace out. Peace and blessings, everybody. Have a great day. Peace, brother. Peace. <clears throat> well, there you have it. Another show in the books. Hey. Listen, I enjoyed this show. It was a really, really good show. A lot of good content happening. Uh, Olivia, the Oracle, definitely lined D. Durrell up. All those women, you know, they had their heels on when they were stomping him. I felt bad for D. Durrell. I felt bad. She brought him over, like, you know, you know, like the red light district and shit. Olivia, the Oracle, was out there like, hey, D. Durrell, your name's in the title. We just want to talk to you. Maybe give you a massage or some bullshit. So D. Durrell goes over there, not knowing that as soon as he walks through the door, there was an army ready to jump his ass. <laughs> so she lured him in, and damn, he got stomped out. He got stomped out. But the good thing about that happening is now it's an easy decision for D. Durrell to make because D. Durrell does like the B sector as well. He actually likes the content. He actually really wants to get to know people. And he's starting to really see who people truly are. And I think he put his money in fertile ground. He put his money in fertile soil. I'm glad he didn't go that other direction. I am so glad he didn't go that other dire direction because you could kind of see the character, right? Treasure Lane. Dope ass show. I really, really appreciated him taking time because I know he's a staple in this community. I know he's a staple within the B sector. Like I know that. So for him to go ahead and take that time to talk about us, it, it meant the world to me. I ain't even going to hold you. I don't know why Shaquem was trying to hit the link. I don't get it. I don't understand it because, because Mr. James inadvertently had our back. Because he was calling people out. Not only was he just calling people out, people felt compelled for whatever reason. They felt compelled to spill the beans and tell the truth and be like, yo, you know, uh, I don't really don't got no issues with them. I got issues with the support, like who they're supporting. I got issues with people opening up their platforms for them to have, you know, uh, a voice or whatever. So it's not even about us. That's the craziest thing in the world. It's not even about us. It's about internal beefs. That is insane. And guess what? I'm here to cover that shit. <laughs> y'all have a good one. I'll see y'all at Shaq Hymns. Peace. And you can't stop, yo A lot of niggas lost they pops to the drug game Other niggas lost they blocks when the thugs came yeah. They knew how to box, they ain't know about the slug game Soon as the money get right, that's when the love change uh. Niggas know who to call when they want raw Kiss is the cornerstone of the corner store Woo. B block general, he stay shining In the back of the van, 2 k 9 and My dope so strong, it's giving fiends the hiccups Coke so high, got niggas doing stick up uh. Found out another nigga dead, light the piff up Make sure one is in the head, load the fifth up Played my hand right, baby, I held aces Nothing on the scene but blood and shell casings Ooh. Nike gloves on the team, they can't trace us Snitches in the witness protection, getting facelifts These niggas will never be able to fuck with me Say my grace before I give them a buck fifty <laughs> The whole hood with me, they hating, we all spiffy yeah. Everything's a short shot, none iffy Oh, man, he said I let it bang in your lighter jaw, how do you leaking? Uh, Scrubbed up in the cool 50 on the dash, you know that I'm leaving. Ooh. A hundred rounds, I'm in the bottom of my gun, so I get to squeeze in. Uh, don't fuck on my squad, my nigga, come home, we don't do all that beef in. Uh, come to your house on the weekend, ooh. put on all black on them creeping. Terror recorded, can I see me? Hey. So the fuck gon' have to free me. Huh? I'm a lion, that's it, rah rah. Hey. Yeah, whenever I be eating. Hey. In the streets, I be hearing up. Hey. Matter of fact, I be at the mall. Got the pulling out them damn blue. Y'all be fell in love, cause I like the ball. Hey. Don't get me started, I clear the house. A nigga used to breaking all the law Caught the grim, then I caught the ball Caught oh. the zip, then I caught it all Tell your body, better pipe down Catch you lacking when you out of bound When I click it back, the bullet bite down ah, Click ah. it back, the bullet bite down You all the rats, so you can get raw I take your cheese in yeah. Your bitch wanna fuck and I got a way to pussy be queefing ooh, ooh. My own some liquor, I roll some gay You know she be cheapin' And if I get a print, she take a blame B Cause I won't let her keep it ooh.